Welcome. Just because I was not ready to go to bed, I decided to just start a stream. Might as well. Nothing else going on. So here we go. Those of you that join me, join me. Those of you that do not, do not. And yeah, that's about it. Here we go. Let's do it. That's what I say. Let's do it. We'll see what happens. If we can get into some shenanigans, we can get into some shenanigans. If not, we don't. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We will see what happens. We will see what comes around. And yeah. Here we go. Ah. Trying to do a million things at once. All right, that got sent. That got sent. There we go. We will see what happens. Goldfish, hello. How are you? How you doing? Hot Rod, what's up? Yeah, I decided I wasn't ready to go to bed. I didn't want to watch TV, so I was like, you know what? Maybe I will. Mike, what's up? It's great to see you too, Fish. How you doing, girl? I was a good... Very good. And we will see what happens. We will see who comes in. It's the most we can do, right? See what happens. See who comes in. See what comes out of it. And we will see. We will see. Hello, beautiful Lisa. Been a long day, thus I haven't been around. I missed your hubby screen stream. Went and it's done already. Glad you are on. Well, that's what I said, dream fish. I was like, it's kind of early to be ending everything. Should I start a stream? And he was like, go ahead if you want. And Lisa said, I'll be there for a little bit if you do. So I was like, you know what? We will toss the dice and see what happens. Ian, what's up? How's everybody doing on this beautiful Tuesday? Some of you were in Jimmy's stream, so some of you I already know what how you doing. But yeah, squirrels lurking. Squirrel's always lurking. I'll send Squirrel a link just because he's Squirrel. He's Squirrel. We all know what Squirrel's like. We will see. Oh, thanks, Fish. I'm going to smoke a cigarette and then I'll join you. Fish giving hugs. 
Squirrel, I sent you a link on Hangouts if you decide you want to join. If not, that's okay. Thank you, Goldfish. She thinks you look great even without seeing you, Squirrel. Ian's here. Ian, what's up? This isn't really a wrestling stream, but whatever. We will deal with whatever comes our way. You know? Whatever comes up, comes up. Whatever don't, don't. How are you doing? You are always so kind. Thank you, Fish. You're very easy to be kind to, Fish. This is a fun stream. So far, so good, Fish. So far, so good. I try to be kind. I try to be understanding. I try to listen. It's all good. The closest people to me make it easy to do those things. I was messing with my railroad, making progress. Very nice, Mike. You're dealing with your foam. Mike's dealing with his foam. Glad to hear you're making progress, Mike. It's what matters. It's the little things that matter. Thank you, Goldfish. Yep, cutting it ain't easy. Laughing my ass off. I'm sure it's not. Is it messy? Any foam I've dealt with has always been messy to cut. I don't know if it's the same type of foam that you're dealing with or if it's a special foam because it's for the railroad. Dorito, what's up? Thank you, thank you. I appreciate you popping in and smashing the like button. Not beaded foam. This is extruded. Very nice, very nice. Fish said hello to Dorito. Dorito saying hello to Squirrel. Dorito saying hello to Fish. Insulation foam without the foil. Oh, okay. Eight watching and seven likes. I might be one of those watching. I think I do still have my YouTube. I do. I still have my YouTube side up. So I might have been one of those ones. The pink stuff. Same old, same old homeboy. Very good. At least it's nothing new, Dorito. It's nothing new. As you can all see behind me, Gamer, not a great gamer, made me a new video to play behind me. Hey, Miss Doris and everybody. Daryl, welcome. How you doing, buddy? Daryl's here. I thought you were going to bed, Daryl. Didn't you say you were going to bed hours ago? I thought you were going to bed. I could be wrong. Missy, what's up? How are you? How are you doing? I was in and out, Daryl said. That's how I was last night, Daryl. 
could not fall asleep for the life of me. If I did fall asleep, I'd be awake in an hour or two. I am doing good, Missy. I just decided to start a random stream because Jimmy ended the stream and I wasn't ready to go to bed. So I was like, you know what? Screw it. We'll see what happens. We'll roll the dice and see what happens. I hope all is good with everybody. I had problems sleeping at the hospital. That's how it goes, Mike. You're in a different place. And when you're in a different place, you tend to have a hard time sleeping. Understandable. All right. Apparently, I got rid of my chat. Did I get rid of my chat? Yes, I did. I got rid of my chat. We will see if I can get it back up. I got rid of my chat. We'll see. Gary. Gary's here. Ah. Ah. Good to see you, Gary. I did, I'm glad you decided to pop in. Mike's having back spasms and stuff. Slept all day. Something good on TV, though. Very nice, Mike. Goldfish said, Gary's candle is always so nice. He is, Goldfish. He is. It's very nice. I just got your notification. Glad. I haven't been on very long. A few minutes. I just decided to start a stream just because. Just like the title says. Just because. Gary said, it's always good to see you, Goldfish. She is always nice, Gary. I agree. Goldfish is a sweetheart. So, anybody get any big plans for the week? Diet Cola, how are you? He's home from work and eating tacos now. Very nice. Eat the tacos. Yeah, he had a good stream, Gary. I'll give him that. He had a good stream. So how's everybody doing? I know most of you I've seen in Jimmy's stream, so I made myself, I made my shelf for controls. Came out very nice. All with scrap wood. Very nice. Yeah, Jimmy actually made a whole chicken coop out of scrap wood that we had lying in the yard. Did a good job. Two years later, it's still standing. Or it might even be three years now. Daryl said, good, and you?
Right, Gary? Nine hours. Yep. Well, and that's why he was like, you know what? I'm just going to call it. Someone else could start a stream. And I said, all right. I'll start one. I don't care. If people come up, people come up. If they don't, they don't. Yeah. I think it was a mix of a lot of things, Gary. He tired. He had too much to drink. He needed some food. Hey, Chris, how are you? Thank you for popping up and saying hello. Nice, Missy, nice. Chris, how's life cheating you? You may be, like, one of the only ones we didn't see in Jimmy's stream earlier. Diane Cola, I don't know if we saw too much of, but. We didn't see too much of Go Fish earlier, either. She was busy. Chris said, all good here. Nice to hear. Nice to hear. I can't tight fingers are too big, Gary said. That's all right, Gary. You're not the only one, brother. You're on a phone. I don't know if I could type on a phone in a stream. I was at work while he was streaming and didn't get a chance to stop in and say hi, Diet Cola said. Like I said, I wasn't sure if we saw you or not. It was like an eight or nine hour stream. I can't type on a phone, Mike said. Very nice. Did you mean no? He's still up, Missy. I think he's just chilling, watching some videos. He just wants to be able to lay back for a little while. Who wants to be my flushy snuggle blanket? Damn it, it's cold here. Budget bushcraft said. Yeah, it's getting kind of chilly here, too, Budget. It's supposed to be down to the 20s tonight. But that's why I have a heating blanket of a dog. She warms you up quite nicely when you have to get up and pee. Unfortunately, she's also got to go outside to pee, so... Sometimes she's what causes you to get cold. I got my little heater going on trying to save fuel. Missy said it's cold here and light snow. Yeah, we had a light dusting last time I brought Tilly out. I was kind of surprised. Because I did not know it was supposed to snow. It didn't look like it was going to mount too much. But there was definitely a covering on the cars.
I don't know if we're going to get any more tonight. Later this week, a warm spell. We had that last week, Mike. Love the backdrop. Yeah, this is a new video backdrop backdrop that uh, Gamer made me. Budget took a short nap inside the RV. It's 51. I don't know if that's good or bad, Budget. Friday is supposed to be 65, Gary said. Yeah, I haven't really looked at the weather much. But Jimmy was saying that it's not supposed to get too warm around here. We had a warm spell last week. And from what he was saying, that is pretty much it until like April. I think we are going to be going into a cold spell, which is more suitable for this time of the year, so I'm good with it. Alexis, how are you? Welcome, my love. Thanks for stopping by. Lisa's supposed to be coming up at some point. She was going to go out and have a cigarette and then join me. Bushcraft, don't you have a ceramic heater? We have one. We don't run it too much, though. It usually stays in Jimmy's office. Because that's like the coldest room in the house, so... That is where that stays. Yeah, we've locked out so far this year. I run mine 24-7, Gary said. I wish I could, Gary. Wish I could. Unfortunately, we don't pay the bills, the utility bills. So we end up hearing from about it from the landlord. I have a disc heater needs a box to put it on. Ah. Thomas. Thomas says hello. Here he comes. Can see a little bit of him. He's like, hi. Now that I know Daddy's stream's over and Mama's streaming, I'll come over. I found electric for zero five five three per kilowatt an hour. Budget said, Gary Skinnell, I have a fuel furnace and three heaters didn't have any running I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing budget I know we have a I think it's propane we have a propane tank that runs our heat and electricity But us being the bottom floor, we're really the only ones that need to run our heat because it pretty much heats the whole building. The other apartments say if they turn the heat on, they're too hot. Gary said, Bushcraft, I'd run one of UM Mod Electric around here is point zero eight eight nine per kilowatt. Yeah, I don't know what ours runs off of. Like I said, we have propane heat, so it just gets filled regularly. Every month the guy comes by and fills the tank, whether it needs it or not. And 
we don't ever see the bill because it's included in our rent. So I have no idea what we use. Thomas is just chilling over there in Jimmy's clothes thing. Just chilling, hanging out. Like, what you doing? Gary said his is $60 a month savings. Is that worth running the electric propane heater, Gary? Diacola said I have electric heat, but I get the bill for it. Yeah, I think we're the only apartment that has cooking and heat electric. But like I said, we don't really see the bill for it. Um, and I know our propane is hooked in. I think that's what runs our heat, but I'm not 100% sure. Here in Pennsylvania, we have an electric company, but then you have to find a supplier. Gary said, I have a ceramic heater that's cheaper. All I know is when we talk to our landlord about running a ceramic heater, he said that he thought it would be too expensive. So I don't know what the cost is to heat the building, but I wish I had a wood stove too, Diet Cola. We had a fireplace in one of the houses we lived in, and it was awesome. It was so much warmer than like natural gas or electric. Why is it that Mama starts a live stream and you're like all over the place? Daddy starts a live stream and you can't be found. Why is that? Daddy Lynn ran a live stream for eight hours. My neighbor uses wood and it stinks. I can't stand the smell since my niece died in a house fire. Yeah, Gary. Unfortunately, when shit like that happens, that's what you associate it with. Like, I never really minded the smell of burnt wood. But I'm sure if, like, there was devastating fire, I would. Got the big buddy propane heater, burns my legs, and the cat's tail. Budget said. Yeah, we have a um, my buddy heater for camping. Because we hunt. You write, it's consistent reminder and it never bothered me before. Yeah. And unfortunately, because it just happened within the last year, it's probably going to take a while before you stop associating that smell. With what happened. Yeah, I'm assuming the My Buddy heater we have, it runs off of propane. It's probably a smaller version of the one that Budget has. I know that normally heats our camper pretty well if we go hunting during the winter and we camp in the camper. Can you please send me a link on Hangouts? It's easier for me to get there from my computer. 
Yes, Lisa. I can do that. Lisa, 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 there you are. There you go, my love. Just sent it. It's a 32 foot. I called my brother earlier. He didn't want to talk. RV said it's a 32 foot RV and they don't make these things airtight. Lisa, there's a link coming to you, Gary said. Hello, Fisher with Christina. Yeah, I think with our camper, we have a pop-out. But if we pop it, like if we put both sides out, I think we measured it out at like 26 feet. And obviously with two canvas ends, it's not airtight at all. But uh, yeah. The my buddy heater doesn't do too bad with it. And there she is. Mm, there she is. I forgot I did put a link. <laughs> I'm like, you need a link, really? You need a link? <laughs> Lisa? I forgot. All this time, people, she didn't even need a link. All she needed to do was come at goddamn stream yards. <laughs> Hi, Daryl. Hi, Hi, I'm Fisherman Christina. Gary. Budget. Everybody in chat. Hello, hello. And Daryl said, Lisa pooted? No. Lisa, you pooted? No, I didn't poot. I'll Are tell you, you sure? if I did. I, I didn't. I would tell you if I did. They were just like picking them. You know? Gary, why do you find that so hard to believe? That the Eagles lost to the Giants? No, I did forget fish. Go fish. <laughs> hey, Mike. Gary said, Lisa, haven't seen you in a while. Ha ha ha. Get a dog age. <laughs> and then Gary said, Giants suck. They do suck now. Weren't they once upon a time one of America's team along with the Dallas Cowboys? I could be yeah. wrong. I think so. I think they were. Mm -hmm. I and now look at, suck. now look at, they both suck. The Cowboys and the Giants. So long as I don't use the stove or oven, I get a couple of months of propane for the furnace. Propane. Very nice budget. But how are you gonna, not going to use your stove or oven? Unless you wear out every goddamn night. Dave Larson. There's ways. There's ways he can um wait, he does he have electric? Um no, he's in a camper that's all propane. Oh. Yeah, how the hell he, oh he could cut wait, where does he live? Um, I don't know if he lives in the camper, but he's been talking about a, I think, 32-foot camper. Because depending on where he lives, he can cook outside. Right? Oh. Microwave. Oh. Sorry, budget. I forgot. I do not live off of my microwave. Yeah, me neither. I don't cook anything in my microwave. I defrost. I don't cook. All right, a warm up soup. Hey, Dave Larson. Yeah, Christina, if we're going to count years, I'm sure there could be different years that different teams were America's football team. 
It's just there's certain teams that they always refer to as America's football team. And I know the the Cowboys are one of them. I think I'm going to add the round table to this. I think it's like one of the original, the original football teams from when they first started football, which are like four teams, I think. Hey, Mark, what's up? Oh, there goes Lisa. It's an apartment with six wheels, Budget said. I'm sorry, Budget. I did not mean to shit on your apartment with six wheels. Lisa fell off. Yes, Lisa did fall off. I think she was going to do something, and depending on what she was on, she could only do one thing at a time. She's back, though. Yeah. I was going to say, I don't, need, I don't know if I need to let her in or not. <laughs> no, I remembered. She remembered. Budget said it's all good. She yells for a link and then cuts out, Gary said. Oh. Here you go, Fish. Hey, Gary. Hey, Daryl. Hey, Dave, Mark said. <laughs> and if you all just heard that, you heard Mark go, <sighs> That's because he's eating. He's eating. He's eating. That was probably his... I don't know if I can eat any more, Sai. No, I just got home. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I didn't mean to leave Goldfish. I meant to add the Roundtable channel to this, too, and I messed hit the wrong button. <laughs> I already put it on the Roundtable chat. No, I mean, like, the channel. Oh, the YouTube channel. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I thought that was a spirit saying, oh, Gary, that was last night's stream. Come on. Mark, you missed it. Last night we had a spirit box going on my stream. Really? Mm-hmm. We did a little bit of everything last night. It was really good. How did that go? It went pretty good. We could understand most of what they were saying. And we deemed that um, Cash's house is really haunted and he's got a lot of spirits in there. And he may need to do something about it. Gary said we had six hours of fun. Damn, I'm yes, jealous. I did. <laughs> yep. I ended that stream at like. I think like 2.30 this morning. Awesome. Started at 8. Yep, we went from wrestling to spirit talk to shenanigans. Well, I'm glad the spirit box session went well. Yeah, the funny thing was we started out after wrestling got done. Everybody wanted me to keep the stream going. So I was like, all right. And then we were talking about weird shit that was happening in Cash's house while the stream was going on. And he was like, well, I happen to have this spirit box app on my phone. And we were all like, oh, turn it on. Go ahead, turn it on. So he turned it on and we played with that for a little while. Oh, he's right there. You little shit. Anthony. Anthony. <clears throat> I wouldn't want to enter nothing spiritual because then you may open up the long door. And well, yeah, Christine, a lot of people that do that kind of know what they're doing and it happens, but, you know. Yep, Anthony's barking. 
If anybody from the round table side wants a link to join panel, let me know and I'll send the link. Yes. I my head was hurting early today, but I took some Tylenol and it went away. Gary, the SP7 is my house. Yeah, the Necrophonic was the app that Cash had on his phone. Yeah, and Gary, Mark has the SP7. So, like, some of it we could understand. Other parts of it were kind of scrambled. And <clears throat> I was trying to, my friend Lou Locke was live streaming. And he was getting the uh, super chats after Jimmy ended. I went over to Lou Locke's and said hello. And, oh, my gosh, Omar was there and sent him a super chat. Really? I tagged in Omar's um, attention because I wanted to ask him permission for us to use his spirit box over at um, Carol Bassett's. Because if we have his permission, then we can use it. Yeah. Then we can use it. But the chat, uh, Luvak had almost 200 people in that chat. So Omar didn't see it. That's the hardest thing when you get somebody like that. It's like trying to get their attention. I can. I mean, he has social media, and he and he answers his emails more than he does his social media. So I could always email him. But Anna, I'm crazy. Hello, Anna, I'm crazy. Anthony, did you want a link? Does anyone from the round table want a link? See, I don't see any of those people. Seth, hello. There's 19 watching all together, go fish. See, I'm showing 21. Now, yep, it just jumped to 21. The uh, SP7 and Spirit Box is really good. I've used that box for like six years and it's good. Yeah, my friend, um, his, his name is uh, his name is Small Town Paranormal. Uh, he is a YouTuber, and uh, that part about the box room. Uh, him and I went to hang out one day and did a couple of spirit box sessions, and we did do a private session. And that box kept saying Lisa's name. Yeah, I didn't know Mark at the time. Yeah. I was going to say, that's when you didn't know her, right? Yeah. <laughs> I remember you talking about that. Yeah. Um, my wife then, <laughs> well, I say, should say my ex-wife, didn't like that conversation that me and Steve were having with these spirits because they were they kept on saying Lisa's name, and then they kept on saying YouTube and marriage and happiness. And, like, we were trying to figure out who Lisa was. Like, who is this Lisa woman that you y'all are talking about? And it was a guy's voice that came through the box all the time. And it was like a like a man's voice. And oh. I'm here and here I am. <laughs> Sorry, yeah. Anthony, I don't know how long you were down there, but Oh I man, uh, you should have me down there a little longer. She was almost there. <laughs> she was almost there. <laughs> Oh. So, Lisa, yes. this Sunday at Survivor Series, it's going to be Drew McIntyre, my new man, versus no, Roman Reigns, your man. Oh, oh, so you dump Roman for the, your new man? Well, and I said that I would give Roman up to you, and I would take Drew, because Drew... That's very kind of you. Oh, yeah, I hate that yeah. so nice. <laughs> Because Drew is just as good looking to me. You hear that and shit, Mark? <laughs> yeah, but he's got a very nice Scottish accent to go along with him. Lord gave me Roman Reigns. She See, dumped him. That's I true. Mark, Mark. Mark just keeps saying it's the hair. <laughs> that's hair. true. I think I'll keep Drew behind me just to show you what Drew looks no. like. 
No, Let's I didn't like, do a link. Uh, you. <laughs> you do? You heard it. They she always do like a link. Like, <laughs> Dale, will you like a link? I don't know how to get you a link, but if you want a link, we can go press with Jimmy. I have Daryl's wife on Facebook, but if I hit up Jimmy, Jimmy could probably send him the link. Nora, I think I sent you a link. I sent Nora a link too. Hi, Patch. Welcome. Hey, Patch. You know, Patch, last night I was completely wrong. I was like, I'm pretty sure I met Patch in Jimmy's stream. And Jimmy was like, nope, I don't think I've ever met Patch. I'm like, okay, so maybe I didn't meet him in your stream. Were you originally to my stream or did you join us during our Friday streams with Lisa? Yeah, cemetery is all very active, Gary. Yeah, they are. <sighs> Gary's being a tattletale. He said, Nora spam in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody hey. likes a tattletale, Gary. Yeah, because tattletales get to go in the basement with me. <laughs> 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 I'll give you something to tell. <laughs> There's a love stream. Yeah. There's a love stream oh, between okay. you. And so Pat joined me from Mandy's Mixed Media Screen. We're all in trouble now. I, I was just, I, I'm just here to hang out in the basement with Anthony. That's, that's <laughs> <laughs> Thomas, Thomas, the fucking squirrel's here, Thomas. What the fuck's going on? No what's, good. What's the matter with your lousy fucking husband? He's too good for us. Fuck him. Apparently. Lousy bastard. Right. <laughs> Listen, folks, I'm not being mean. I'm just calling you to him. And sometimes, sometimes it's not being mean to someone when you're describing them. Nora yeah. said, um, <laughs> okay, but someone has to mod the chat. Oh, my right on cue. Hey, look, squirrel. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> ah, fuck, there he is. Where is he? Fuck it, Jimmy. So you know, Jimmy you're lousy, just but you're a lousy motherfucker. Parents on this stream. Right? You shut up on my stream. Listen, I, I gotta yeah. I guess I guess I should I should thank Jimmy though. Because I was sitting here at my desk and if I was it wasn't listening. for Jimmy, you would have never met me. Well, well, that's there's true. that. There's that too, Doris. That's obviously, true. obviously, that's true. Um, <laughs> but I was sitting here and I was, I was putting together a couple of videos. And I needed to catch. I need to catch up. I to catch up. And I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'll do this video later. I'll do it tomorrow. I'll get on and fucking chat with Jimmy. And, and I put the fucking earbuds back in. And fucking. And then that's what he was like. Fuck it. And I was like. I went over and I was going to the link that he had sent me, and Jimmy's like, "All right, well, I'm calling it a fucking night." I'm like, <laughs> I was fucking ten seconds away from the door, and I was like, "You know what? Fuck it." It's funny because Fish fucking, said the same thing. Yeah. Fish was like, "I just jumped on a stream," and he yeah. was like, "I'm just gonna call it." Yeah, I, and then so I was like, "Fuck it!" So I finished the she video. Was like, oh, I was so excited when you started a stream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw you started. I started listening. I went and finished the video, and I got it all set to go out tomorrow morning at 7 a.m., so I'm done. And then uh, Bashful. Oh, Bashful. Even Bashful's here. Hey, listen. Jimmy, you are I gave a, right now. I gave a special mm -hmm. nod to Bashful when I did my reaction video, the last reaction video I did. A little nod to Bashful. Oh, yeah? Yep. There is. It's a little one. I can hold on. I'll even be a nice guy and I'll tell you the timestamp on it. All right. I ain't gonna make you fuckers oh, watch it. Okay. You. Mm -hmm. Man, see that? I'm not even gonna make you fucking lazy asses watch it. I'm just gonna tell you the timestamp. <laughs> hold on, we find it. <laughs> Jimmy's jealous. I got bashful Tony and Go Fish on my stream. I've Lisa, Tony, oh, yeah. and Anthony on my panel. Nora's about to join panel. He's just worried about moderators in my chat. Gary and Dave will take care of it, Nora. 
Don't worry about really. it. But we'll just be real good at ignoring them. <laughs> <laughs> Dave Watson's here. Dave Watson's here. He's a pit bull. He's got this. There you go. Yep. Yes, Patch, it was. It was because um, Fish was the one that messaged me Bindi's stream and asked me to go over there. So it would have been her that put my link in the chat. So it would have been Fish that originally put <laughs> us up. Thank you, Fish. Thank you, Fish. Um, fish yeah. is good peoples. Fish. There you go, Lisa. Right in the fucking chat. At the, right at the four minute mark. Basically, here, I'll spoil the whole fucking video for you, right? So you really don't have to watch it. I react to this guy, and he's talking about how he's got this tiny little dick, and when he smokes meth, his dick gets big and rock hard, and four strokes, and he comes. And he's like, it's the best cum you ever had. Four strokes is all it takes when you're smoking meth. The more you smoke, the harder it gets. But my comment is at the four-minute mark. What's up, Mark? How you doing, brother? I wasn't talking about you when I was talking That's about you. Know. Was. <laughs> <laughs> That's so, yeah, my, 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 my little nod to, my little nod to bashful. Yeah, yeah. What about the four-minute mark? Method. 403. 403, 404. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Thank you for supporting me. You heard that, Squirrel? What's up? You hear that? Mark in the background going, quit telling them everything. What the hell? <laughs> Make them watch your video. All right. I got okay, can I, I'm going to drop another link. I was going to ask, but I'm just going to drop another link. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. You got me in rare form. Where the fuck is it? There it is. I'm almost there, Doris. One on two in rare form. Um, it's true. It's fucking true, folks. Hey. <laughs> Lisa, Lisa's not fucking pulling any punches. She's absolutely right. All right, let's see. We go. Yeah. And if you watch Jimmy's most recent video, it actually has Go Fish's music in the background. Mm -hmm. A quick backstory for everybody that's here. Uh oh. Quick backstory. <clears throat> so I did this challenge on uh, I co-host on the Creative Spotlight on Saturday nights, and we did this challenge where people made new channels and shit. You know. Don't forget, you said it would be quick. It's, yeah, well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tell you a true story. This guy Jerry used to work with when I was start telling a story. He would step right in. He would go, "Just so you know, Tony only has two kinds of stories. Tony has a five-minute story and a twenty-minute story, and then he'd turn <laughs> he'd." He, he would turn to walk away, and he'd immediately turn back around. And he'd go, and just so you know, I've never heard a five-minute story. Anyways, I had made a channel. It was about going to Dollar Tree or whatever, and I decided I wanted to keep the channel but not the same concept, so I rebranded the channel, and I called it This Is, and I started making these videos, you know. You know, this is blah, blah, blah whatever. Yeah, they're very short videos. They're kind of cool. I think they are. So then – but. But the email is drop mic repair, blah, blah, blah. It's, it's all too fakakta when you change every time you change channel names. So I, I'm going to scrap it. I'm going to move those videos over. And I started a new channel. And it's called Eat My Hashtag Shorts. So, um, so anyways, here's the, here's the video I just put up tonight if you guys want to check it out. Um, but, anyways, that's. Uh, Eat my shorts. It's it's so that's gonna be the second channel I'm gonna work on. It's just so I can. I've been putting all these short videos up on the squirrel, and I want to stick with what I've been doing with squirrel. So I want to do more. Go back to doing one of my fuck you videos. I got to get back to doing what I do on this channel, you know. So those little short ones, I'm, I'll, I'll have a place to dump those, you know. So, but this new one, I thought I thought I did a pretty good job with it. I can tell you right now if I could, I'd like to cut myself a bit. Okay. I'm over it. Hey, hey, I, I Mr. Hey, unfortunately for you and your daddy, now I'm live. So you gotta go see daddy. Right. Take Let's go, Jimmy. You lousy stream shutting bastard. Take the fucking dog Jimmy's out. Jimmy's gonna break. go out. <laughs> and now this is my live stream. Right. You're no longer live. Yeah. So, so if you were fucking, if you were still fucking streaming back ahead. <laughs> If you're still streaming, you can pull the old, well, I'm the host, so I can't go. 
<laughs> Why are you eating you can't even pull that if I'm on the like a ragged table. Mm-hmm. And listen, I said if I'm on panel, you can't even do the I'm a host because I could just take host. <laughs> I, I also want you guys to know anybody who anybody who is goes in, his thing. This is I can't leave. It's my live stream. Yeah, well, that's what I'm saying. That's that's you see now he's wishing. Sometimes Scroll forgets why he makes videos. Hey, well, hey, fuck you, Gary. Uh, you see that? You <laughs> There's no, a fucking video coming out tomorrow morning, Gary. It's actually an old one. I've been sitting on forever, and I keep forgetting. Hold on, Basil. Um, Lisa, yeah. if you would like, would you send uh, Josh a link? Oh. Uh, <laughs> God. Um, so, anyways, that, <laughs> that other channel of mine. Feel free to take that video and just share it out. It's okay. Do what you want. <laughs> you know, fuck. So that's another channel that's not look squirrel. <laughs> it's not viewed this. Not here look squirrel. It's it's basically it's basically the other. It's a second channel for me for this channel, so that I don't keep dumping all these short videos on my channel. It's just a place where I can just dump short videos and walk away. I'm not going to invest time. If the fucking algorithm picks them up and runs with them, cool. I'm just going to keep dumping them over there. I got two so yeah. far. I did, I did one yesterday called Ball Sacks. And then, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and today it was uh, Whale Almost Eats Kayaker, which is uh, interesting. Thing. Whale Almost Eats hey, Kayaker. That's correct. Hello, my sexy sister, Alexa. Unless I can't stop, Alexis. I appreciate it. Thank, thank you, Go Fish Office. I appreciate it. My fucking did the squirrel swirl there with the camera. So, yeah, Bashful, that's the link I just dropped. Hello, Anthony. The Bashful, did you see my little fucking nod to you in my video, Bashful? Where are you, Bashful? He's going to walk. I didn't even there. see her. She was fucking here. It was just a four minute back, Bashful. He uh, even gave us the timestamp. Why do I not see Bashful? Because she's on the round table chat. I was going to say, I haven't seen Bashful in chat either, but Lisa's responding to her like she's commenting. Oh, so. I fucking, you, I fucking hate it when I get on these streams and don't know <laughs> when I'm on them. It happens all the time. Or I'll be in one of them, and, and you guys, like, it's not just you guys, but when people are doing dual streams, I'll be in one of them and someone's fucking talking to somebody. I'm like, where the fuck are they seeing this shit? I'm you know, what the fuck are I'm 25. I did Just have 25 people in here. I don't think I've ever had that many people in one of my streams. You're welcome. That's because I'm here. Hello. So Thank you, Squirrel. Yeah. Thank Sorry. you. Everybody Sorry. knew when Jimmy shut down, they're like, the squirrel's going to end up going up on fucking doors to streams. We're going to go hang out and wait for him. I'm here, folks. Here I am. You're welcome. All right. Now all you motherfuckers can go to bed. Boy, you, boy, go. You, know when we, you know when we do stream, it counts everybody. How many people's in my stream and how many people's in yours. It counts it as one on this side. Oh, what's up, there, guys? Yeah. Hey, look, I'm going to take some of this now. because Yeah. I oh, I that. know that, Lisa. I told you that. <laughs> that was why I haven't been seeing all the comments. I'm fucking commenting, too. Because I don't look at my fucking comments, you bitch. <laughs> She wanted a link. I fucking said. <laughs> I, I the fuck I don't think I have. Fucking we all when I was trying to go live and around people too. Anthony, I'm sorry. I didn't know you commented before. I was. Yeah. What's up, this bro? What's going on, Josh? <laughs> no, I'm not sure. You if you're uh, nothing much, man. Same old shit, different day. You know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Commented. I'm oh. not sure if you guys watch baseball or not, but what if your guys? Opinions on the Marlins, the first women as the general manager. I don't watch baseball, Anthony, so I haven't yeah. really watched any of the games, so I don't think I can really comment on what I yeah, think. I, can't yeah. I don't want, I don't oh, want to me. So <laughs> Is this in recent chat? Yes, apparently. If you go to StreamYards and That's you go cool. to comments, you'll be able to see comments from both channels to make yeah. it a little bit easier. You'll see both chats going on. Yeah. Do you have that option? 
Like if yeah, you go to the right, it says comments, banner. I'm sure I do, but I have the chat popped out, so that way, I, so that way I can actually chat if I want to. But you know what? I can just hide that back there and at least put this up so I can see it. Hey, check that out. Hi, Wolfie. What's going on, Wolfie? Hey, Best how are you? Hey, Doris, let me ask you a question. What do you yeah. think about Drew McIntyre uh, regaining the WWE Championship? Do you not see the man behind me, Josh? Obviously, I am happy about it. <laughs> Same. Oh. I agree with you on that 100%, dear Doris. When did he get it back? I, last night. What? Yeah, last night, dear. He was facing... He had a... You know this? Championship match rematch last night, and he won really? the title. I didn't fucking know that. Really? Well, if you oh. watch my fucking stream, motherfucker. You know uh, listen, motherfucker. I listened about half your fucking stream last night. <laughs> right, well, obviously, you didn't fucking listen last night because you well, were I I was hanging out with the wife. Drew McIntyre yeah. won the fucking title. Out with the fucking wife. Dude. Well, I didn't even fucking watch the stream last night. Yet. I was watching it live when it happened. Yeah. Well, I can't watch it live because I don't have fucking TV. All right? I'm not paying for cable, number one. <laughs> number two, I was with my wife watching something else on Netflix. Thank you very much. But yes. And usually, the next day, WWE usually regurgitates 10,000 videos into my fucking news feed because I'm subscribed to them. <laughs> so... I'm surprised I didn't see it. So well, this I Sunday, I saw last night that stuck out was for Monday was uh, the Bray Wyatt versus uh, whoever the fuck he fought match. He fought somebody. Um, I, I think you were thinking like last week because Bray Wyatt actually no Bray Wyatt was in a match against the Miz. Right, that's what the. There was really nothing major that went on. I think. Yeah, Rex the Bloods jumped and knocked them nuts over the yeah, fucking Yeah, knocked okay. more out. Yeah. It's so, out. this Sunday, I think I will have to commit Lisa into doing a live stream with me during Survivor Series because she's a Roman Reigns girl and I am a Drew McIntyre girl. So they will be facing each other, champion versus champion. By the way, what do you speaking of Survivor Series? What do you guys think about the Undertaker's final farewell being at Survivor Series? I mean, uh, what else I, can you think about it? It's exactly thirty days, thirty years to the fucking day on the same the show. Day I mean, that he made hey, what, what, do you, what do you think about? It? That's amazing. Hey, uh, Doris, to me personally, I think it's fitting. Because The Undertaker made his debut at Survivor Series, I believe, of 1990, if I'm not mistaken. And 30 years later, he's going to retire. He's going to give his final farewell at that uh, pay-per-view. And like I said in Lisa's stream the other night, I don't care what other people think. To me, The Undertaker will always be my all-time favorite superstar. 21 and 1. 21 and 1 WrestleMania streak will never be duplicated or replicated. Excuse me, actually 21 and 2. Oh, yes. They, After he lost about that. Brock Lesnar, he lost to Roman Reigns. Yes. Thank and you for correcting me on that. And he is my ultimate favorite wrestler. Agreed. To hear that. for the person that is the wrestler. If you've watched any of his documentaries, anytime he has a big match, he ends up having to have <laughs> either a major operation or major recovery time to recoup from that match. So old. That in Wait a minute. says he needs to retire. Wait, can I ask you something, Doris? Is that why they only had him like appearing? Very scarcely on like Raw and SmackDown and then at WrestleMania. Is that, that why? Is exactly why, Josh. Because okay, I was wondering about that. I'm just trying to get in there if I can for a second, uh, no. Josh. No. <laughs> just wanted to point out Gary Scandal is 24 and 0, folks. Okay, what the fuck? Back to it. Wild man. <laughs> right, because he did win two WrestleManias after he lost the two matches. So technically, it is twenty-four and two, 
But Gary claims that he's 24 and zero. So, but yes, if you watch any of the Undertaker's documentaries or mm -hmm. interviews, he says that he has to stop preparing for WrestleMania well before Survivor Series just to be ready to go at WrestleMania. That's like four to five months of preparation for one match. Which, in all honesty, I think, you know, The Undertaker will go down in the WWE Hall of Fame as one of the greatest of all oh, time. that's a given. That's a given. You know who else will go down? Josh, no one's arguing with you. You act like someone's talking shit about The Undertaker. You're taking it personal. <laughs> Pat Patterson will also go down, Josh. I think that, that is true. I think true. that the Undertaker has earned the rights. As much as people said that Tom Brady earned the right to do what he wanted to do when he went to Tampa Bay, the Undertaker has earned the right to say that he wants to retire. He's done. He doesn't oh. want to quit anymore. Oh, hell yeah, I completely agree. I mean, 30 years of all the bumps and the bruises and the surgeries he's gone through. I agree with you on that, Doris. Fuck that. That's bullshit. He doesn't have the right for anything. Fuck him. Hey, fuck him. <laughs> you listen to me. That motherfucker is dedicated to entertaining me and the rest of you, okay? I so, mean, as much as I might have thought... Me, fucking life as work. much as I might have thought that his WrestleMania, his retirement would be at WrestleMania... It kind of makes sense for them to do it 30 years to the day at Survivor Series. Well, and, to retire. until the and day when he does the right thing. Because for years he couldn't do the right thing, but the situation was there where the right thing could be done, and he didn't do it. The so right thing. He, what the fuck is the so, right thing, Anthony? I grew up loving this guy, and he's awesome, and I think he's a great guy. But I don't think I, I'll never accept his motherfucking retirement until he does the right thing, and that's wrestle fucking Sting, because he could have wrestled Sting. He still can wrestle Sting. But like I say, I've said this multiple times. On my you just let those two old motherfuckers go out there and slap each other on. Like Would you of be fuckers. happy? And then they fucking recuperate. Shut up. Fuck Shut up. Fuck it. Fuck it, Shut up. Guys. Fuck it. Shut up. Would you be happy with a Undertaker sting match? I'm so thinking about the ones. I know. I would be. Because neither one of the motherfuckers could give us the match that we anticipate. Can you imagine it though? Like the Undertaker's in one corner sitting there, his chest is going up and down, he's fucking gasping for air right across the room from him. Fucking stings over there trying to fucking comb his hair back over so nobody can see how fucking bald he is. Like, I would rather not see it than be disappointed and it not be what I was expecting. Oh, it's going to be a disappointment, Doris. Now, yeah. Everything they do is a disappointment. <laughs> Or whatever the fuck you are. Fucking Bret Hart might as well be wrestling at this point. I oh, I'm gonna fucking keep your ass on the fuck So hey, if uh, if you need if you need me, I'm gonna get back. <laughs> Where's Bashful? I was going to say, where's Bashful? Where's Lisa, did you, Bashful? Where's Lisa, Bashful? Did you, did you listen to my comments? We had a fucking comment highlighted forever. <laughs> said, you know, you know who doesn't go down? Me! <laughs> who said that? Oh, I see it now. Bashful. Goodness. I see it now. I, I didn't see it before. Yeah. And um, to go back to... Um, the question in chat by Mr. Stroker. Um, me and Doris share a um, StreamYard account, and on StreamYard, we can go live on both our accounts at the same time. That's great. Thank you, Gary. I'm messing with that. And you, you see what you, you see, you people see what I got to put up with. Mike. Put some money yeah, in the Mike, I told you I have to get in that. Yeah, Mike, 
they make these little orange deals. You, you roll them in your fingers like that, and you stick them in the ears when you're sleeping. That way you can sit there and go, Hey, Anthony, new flash dude. They're called fucking ear plugs. I, I, hey, look, we ain't trying to get to here. We don't want to continue. Josh, can you hear it? Can you hear it, Josh? Well, no. See, Bash, well, the problem is he just didn't get you drunk enough, okay? Just singing it, Josh. Just singing it. Right, Gary? Gary said, don't be pissing Doris off. That's right. Tony. Singing it, Doris. <laughs> Mofo. They were singing. Sing it to us. Kick your ass. Bashful. Jimmy was pimping us out earlier, Bashful. Right? He was. Yeah, Jimmy was pimping me and out. <laughs> he was talking about fucking $50 for dirty underwear and $100. Yeah. Oh, I gotta say, if I pay a hundred bucks for dirty underwear, it was a hundred dollars. Hey, it was a hundred dollars for Josh. There, just forget that problem. Okay, um. Jimmy said it was a hundred dollars for Bashful's bath water and a pair of the round table ladies' dirty underwear. You had to pick one of them, and, you could and then it was one hundred and fifty dollars for It was a hundred and fifty dollars for Lauren's bra and underwear because her shits are huge, and the weight of that of that bra was gonna raise the cost for shipping. Right, and they got to choose their choice. Of the round table women they wanted. What Along if we wanted Skeeter? Wait a second. If I wanted the you want Skeeter? Skeeter? I'm sure Skeeter, Skeeter had Skeeter no And then he said I want a, that he I want a price on a Skeeter. The Skeeter and then he said that he could even, <laughs> when they said, can we have a fart in the bathwater? He said, I'm sure we could work something out. Yeah, oh please. I can always work out a fart in the bathtub. I'm just sending you five hundred dollars. That way, I ain't got a pig. No, hello. <laughs> so, hold on, Anthony. Do you want oh, do you awesome. want the uh, the full set or do you want the full set minus Skeeter? There's two sets available. Oh, no, 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 no. See, no, see. You got Peter. You got Dustin. You got Lisa. You got Laura. You got Doris. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's why I said I don't have to pick. I just give five hundred bucks. Yeah, that? We don't need you to go down the list of round table women. You hear that? I can hear him behind. I can hear Jimmy you behind doors. You got Jimmy. You got <laughs> <laughs> Put me on the list. Put Alexa said. You got Alexa. 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 <laughs> Wait. Hey. Doris, Lisa, this is what I love about your guys. He's back. Hey, Doris, Lisa, this is what I love about you guys' live streams. It's chaotic, it's unpredictable, and y'all talk about anything and everything. I love it. It's fucking oh. shenanigans, Josh. That's what it is. It's fucking shenanigans. <laughs> exactly my point. I love it. Listen, if I cook pasta... And I overcook it. I get so mad at myself for overcooking it. I punish myself by shoving it all up my anus. Just so <laughs> what? That's what I do. It's hey, a punishment. Video. I do it. I don't Listen. It. <laughs> I, I strain it and immediately start stuffing it. I have to do it while it's hot because it's part of the punishment. Gary, thank you for hanging out with us so long. I love you. Just eat it and shit it out to the next day. I'm going to say it more. I told you a hundred times. That's not how you think right now, Tony. The fuck is that? Some of those vibrators going off. Those vibrators. Those vibrators are going off and it's not mine. What the fuck is that? 
Scott. <laughs> it's got to be Josh. I don't know, but it was fucking loud. <laughs> yeah. It's got to be Josh. Especially on the seven point round, one round surround system. Listen, listen to how loud he is when he talks. It had to be. Loud. <coughs> I can't tell. He's muted now. He doesn't know he's muted, probably. Maybe he does. I don't know. Looks like he's trying to talk to you. Don't worry about it. Now they hung up. But yeah, that was my mic. I do apologize, guys. That was my mic. I forgot I have my ringtone on. Hold on a minute. Mark said farting is $25.99 plus tax plus keeping the handling. Okay, guys. Bashful Sorry about said, that. You there? Yep. Bashful said, there you go, Mark. What the fuck? And Alexis said $25. That's a steep, but Damn it. I know how you think, Mark. Business savvy. What is wrong, Josh? Calm down. Josh, yeah. what the fuck is wrong with that guy? Baby, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Have you met Josh? Hey, hey. Hey, Dustin said $30. He'll send you one for a scratch and sniff. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> well, Josh, we can do him up. I almost fell down. Yeah, I'm back over there laughing and farting. <laughs> And he's back. Any grievances about Josh to get up with Ken, the Redneck Connection? His channel link like is it. in my about section. <laughs> Guys, I am so sorry about that. That was my uh, that was my ringtone that was going off. That's why I was trying to mute my mic. I do apologize, but I got my ringtone muted. And it's okay. pretty much muted now. Thank it's you, okay, Josh. Josh. We'll get Jordan touching on a on a on a drumstick. It's okay. Thank God no one's trying to sleep in your fucking house. Uh, hey, um, guys, to be honest, I'm the only one here because my mom and a family friend of ours just left, and right now my brother is in the hospital. Oh, oh no. Be with in the hospital this weekend. You were? Yeah. Well, we're happy. Hey, Mike, Bye, we're man. happy to have you. Hey, I'm happy that nothing happened to you. But yeah, dude, my brother is in the hospital because they found something in his ass. And his neck by the right lymph node right there that they had to take out. They said it was cancer, I guess. I don't know. Oh. But, yeah. But I am happy to report that. Uh, the surgery was a success, and my brother's going to be back home tomorrow. Very nice. Well, I recently was in uh, the hospital for a day myself. I had a blocked rectum, and apparently it was pasta. I want my hot wheel car back, too, damn it. So, so listen, here's, here's, here's the key. If you, if, you overcook, if you overcook two pounds of spaghetti twice in a row, you don't have to punish yourself twice. That's what I learned. Yeah. That's a lot of spaghetti. I have to hold about two and a half pounds, not four. Can't go that way. It's way too much. Be lazy, be wonderful. How are you guys? Thanks for coming back. Hey, she won a bottle of whiskey. Congratulations. Hey, you want a bottle of whiskey? Let me show the cost up my ass. What? Congratulations, <laughs> 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 you But, hey, um, I will let you guys know that. Hey, I will let you guys know that this that Sunday. I'm... This Sunday you're going to be performing at the Wang Center? <laughs> no, you <laughs> son of a bitch. Freaking squirrel giving me shit. What the fuck? I'm not gonna be in any live streams because I'm gonna be watching Survivor Series. Oh, have we? <laughs> okay. God damn! Freaking squirrel giving me shit every time we're on panel. This is fun as fuck. <laughs> 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 I 
Hey, bro, bro. So the day that that happened, bro. Hey, hey, the day. <laughs> bro, bro, the day that that fucking happened, you will be the first one to get tickets to the fucking show, and I will personally mail them to your ass. B, B, you're not really missing anything. Yes. <laughs> He's Josh, and we all have got it up in front of him, and he takes it like a trooper most times. And I have no idea what happened. about Josh Wildman. You take it up with the redneck next and Ken, his link, yes. his channel Feel link, free. is in my about section. Feel free. Josh please came please from Ken. To Ken's <laughs> comment box. Redneck connection. Mm -hmm. Oh man. Ken's gonna charge me the fuck out. I swear. <laughs> hey, uh, Lisa, didn't I meet you? Oh, God. Fuck. Didn't I find out about your channel through Ken? Yep, that's why we refer all comments and complaints to Ken. Yep. Um, <laughs> I can so. sister's channel, Josh. Yes, you met me there. <laughs> <laughs> Josh, will you be will you be my brother channel? Dave. Dave, wait, wait. <laughs> B whistle said I just put my foot out and laughed. Hey, <laughs> hey, so, so, hey, if you need a brother channel, I'm down. Yeah, what, what do you do? What do you do when you? It's like just a bunch of live at the wine hey, videos. Hey, Doris, <laughs> I'm giving. <laughs> Why am I seeing? <laughs> Josh, Josh, I have a better partner for you, Josh. Josh, I have a better brother channel for you. I think you two would get along marvelously. You need to go ask okay. Muggsy. You two would. Oh you two could dude, be dude, okay. The thing about Muggsy is I have no problem with him. I'm not even pissed off about him coming me out that on that one stream where he said, uh, but I'm too young because I had wild child in my name. Come on, come on. You got to tell the whole story. So this is what happened. Shut up, Josh, and let me tell the story. So this is what happened. Josh comes into the roundtable chat. Instead of being wild man, he was wild boy. So wild child. Sorry, he was wild child. Wild child. So Muggsy yeah. said, this is an adult channel. If you're a child, you cannot be in here. So Muggsy timed him out and kept timing him out because he was wild child. So Josh came back as wild man and said, fuck you, Muggsy, can't tie me out no more. I'm not a wild child no more. I'm a man. And Muggsy said, I still don't think you're a man, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's the story. Oh. Yeah, yeah and, I, and I'm not even you're pissed off at him about it because if you think about it, it is 18 and up, and I had wild child in my name, so that made oh, sense, sorry. to be honest. <laughs> so you, Muggsy you was being a smart ass. ass. Yeah, 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 exactly. Muggsy was being a smart ass, and I understood that. And it's just like, okay, you want to be a smart ass? Fine, fuck you, dude. I'll be a smart ass right back. <clears throat> Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. Anyway, so his name <laughs> used to be Wild Child. Hold on, make sure, make sure I'm reading this right. <laughs> Technically, he is over 18, so he is a man. Um, <clears throat> Do you use those same air quotes when you talk about Jimmy? <laughs> he is a man. I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. okay. Hey, um, he's over seven I, inches. <laughs> I didn't realize. Listen, to, I, I, I try to know a lot about my friends and my community on YouTube, and I did not know. I just read. Josh, I did not know you were one of the original members of the round table. That's awesome. I didn't know that. I just read that. And fuck it, where is it? It's in the chat here. Yeah. yeah. Josh was on the original members of the round table. The round table. Huh? Yeah, that's what I, I thought that's what no. I read. Oh, oh my god. Tony. Dave hey, Dave Lawson, I just turned twenty eight September nineteenth of this year, dude. I'm fucking twenty eight years old, dude. Yes, I turned 28 September 19th of this year. <laughs> what? Okay, wow. what was the date? Okay, so, so you know that. What was hold the on, date hold you on. Now? You're 28 and your mama still got to tell you you need a haircut? You can't okay. put no. it on you? I do know that I need a haircut. 
but because of this COVID-19 no. crap, I can't get a haircut because pretty much all the barbers that I know ain't open or they don't want to uh, give out haircuts, to, you know, because of the six feet distance bullshit. <coughs> Are you in a garage or outdoors or indoors? I'm, I'm outside right now. I'm outside. I'm no outside. Neighbors, no within a quarter of a mile, apparently. <laughs> uh, practice in social distancing, Tony. Long before COVID. Okay. <laughs> I eat a one here. Hey. Right now, if I live in a fucking hey. apartment complex and this dude was outside in the stab while fucking yapping on the fucking live stream, I'd be opening the door and be like, "Yo, you shut the fuck up." <laughs> <laughs> hey, squirrel, squirrel. Sad part is. All the neighbors that I have around where I live are literally close together. I mean, I'm not kidding you. I have a neighbor behind the uh, behind my house. I have a neighbor right next door to me. So that six feet distance bullshit that they're saying, yeah, that ain't really working out. <laughs> no, we're not talking droplets. We're talking decibels. Josh, when yeah. there's physical walls or barriers between you, the six feet Distance thing doesn't matter. Sure. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. I I just thought that it was like yeah. six like feet. If they're in the house and you're outside. You're good. Okay, Julio. Hold on, I know why it matters. Hold on, I know why it matters to Josh. I know. Why. I know why. Because he's like um one of those pubs that drill the hole. Yeah. Lisa, Lisa, it's not even like that. Like, I know, well, actually, you know, I know you're giving me shit, so check this out. There's holes in the fence, so what do you want me to fucking do? Seriously, seriously, you really asking that right now? Well, that's, that's up to you. It all depends on what's on the other side of the fence, you know? Yeah, I don't, gonna, I don't care what you do with the holes, Josh. Don't ask me yeah. that question. And not a single of you is going in any of my holes. So I don't yeah. care what yeah. you do with the holes. <laughs> if you got if you have an invention, maybe you get a salad toss to the front. Hey, Dave. Dave. <laughs> you probably end up with splinters on your ass cheeks or rubber on your face. Bad for, bad for. Bad for. Sad part is, sad part is, I actually wanted to do that to see what people fucking thought about it. That's the sad part. I'll tell you what they think. They think you're fucking stupid. That's what they think. There you go. Now you know. I'm not do it. <laughs> I've seen that. A person in the car alone with a mask on. Yeah. Wow. What the man? I can't buy every day like that. Anthony, I can hear you. <laughs> I can hear him too. Dude, I can hear him still freaking busting up laughing with the fuck. Josh, I love you to be so happy. He's laughing at you, dumbass. <laughs> He's not laughing with you. He's laughing at hey. you. Hey, Lisa, if you can't laugh at hey, if you can't laugh out yourself if you can't laugh out yourself, then who can you laugh at? You, I can laugh at you. You must me. laugh an awful lot, Josh. An awful lot. You just can't hear that I'm already laughing. Uh, Josh, I don't know if you knew this or not, but uh, I make my own merch. And if you want, I can make an instructional video on how to make your own merch. Maybe I might do that. And uh All right. And then no more you can, animal. You a hat and you can get oh. some duct tape and a marker. I'm giving you my trade secrets here, but duct tape and a marker, and you can make a jock hat. Or you can, do, uh, you can do fucking wild man if you want. Wild man. Yeah. No more animals. It's pretty, 
Huh? Hey, Anthony, you good, dude? We almost, we almost killed Anthony. We almost killed him. Look at him. <laughs> I'm trying, man. I'm sorry. Anthony, you all right, man? You good? I heard you, yes. <laughs> <sighs> Josh, do you? Uh, but hey, hey, you, guys, guys, me. hey. I'm talking to you. Give me a second here. I'm, I'm addressing hey, I'm you. I'm talking to Josh the panel. You ready? Thank you, Nora. I appreciate it, dude. Thank you for giving Doris ten dollars to Josh and get his haircut. <laughs> <laughs> well, Josh, go get your haircut, and uh, <laughs> Doris, <laughs> Doris has ten bucks. So there you go. <laughs> hey, I, hey, squirrel. Well, sad part is, I'm actually thinking about uh, doing that this uh, this week. Uh, actually, because I know my. Hey, my hair is starting to grow out, and it's like, it's basically like, I think it was you, Anthony, that said that it looked like I had a mop on my head. Do you, uh, <laughs> listen, uh, Josh, do you have any kids? A wet mop. Like, you've been used, that mop's been used and abused, and it needs to, yeah. Mm -hmm. do, you have, do you have any kids, Josh? Can I continue? No, no, I do not have any kids at all. None. Are you planning on having any kids? Thank God. Are you planning on hey, having what? No, no, I no, hey, for I'm not planning on having any kids at all whatsoever. Okay. None. Just ask. Hey, I do understand that and see and see here's the thing, okay? One me is bad enough. We don't need a freaking we don't need any more of me running around for the US. Or any country for that matter. Florida is full of them, okay? Oh, I am. I lived in Florida for 16 years. They're fucking loaded down there. Loaded. Every fucking. Listen, you get the weirdos, the douchebags, the psychos, the nut jobs, the fuck ups. They come from every fucking. <laughs> Everybody in Florida, one of the most common questions you ask somebody is not what's your name, it's where you're from. Hey, where you from? Where you from? And once in a great while, someone will be like, I'm born and raised Florida cracker. That's very, very, very rare. And uh, mostly everybody's from somewhere else, you know? And it's in the middle of the week. But you're gonna meet you're gonna meet some cool fucking handsome motherfuckers like me. And then you're gonna meet some fucking weirdo motherfuckers like uh Oh my god. What's my doing? I'm like <laughs> I'm back, son. Josh. Hey. I'm here. What, what's some crazy wow movie? Dave. Wow, the Humane Society banned him from having kids. Dave, you're gonna kill Anthony. Stop it, dude. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, where are you? Where, where do you live in Florida? Oh, shit. Josh, we just want to know so we don't go there. I where am I living? I'm living in Tucson, Arizona. It's a freaking shithole. Oh, well, that is hey. true. Yes, um, it was modeled after Sandy Shores out of GTA. No, stop. It's not that bad. Exactly my point. Thank you, Anthony. Is that why? Is it Death Valley in Tucson, Arizona? No, 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 no. Death Valley is in Arizona. I think. I don't know. Didn't you but just say you were from not, Tucson, Arizona? Yeah, but it's not yes. Death Valley in Tucson. Death Valley is its own town. Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. Death Valley, is yeah. it right before you get to Tucson? I don't know, to be honest. I, I really haven't gone out of Tucson, to be honest with you. The only time I did was to go to Phoenix, and then I came back here. So I don't know wh how far it is from Tucson. All I know is that Death Valley, Valley is its own city. What, what, or what town or whatever you want to fucking call it. But no, hey, for you those of you on panel... Hey, guys, for those of you on panel and in chat... 
Don't worry. I'm not going to have any kids at all. No. No. Hell no. <laughs> we know why. Dave Walton explained to us. Yeah, why? Society <laughs> <damaged you>. Hi, <clears throat> the, the truth is, it's a hard hell now. Um, oh, damn straight. Right. And that's because you'd have to find a woman that would fuck you first. And, uh, <laughs> hey, no new fetch. Hey. Okay. Oh, here we go. Already done, did that. Not having any kids. Boom, done. Boom, done. Thank God. Now, next subject. Okay, next subject. Hold on, um, Josh. Hold on, Josh. When you already did done do that, <laughs> is that what the woman said too? Big gun. It was over. It's over. Hi, Ken. Fuck the wham bam. Thank you, ma'am. What? Don't fucking act like you brand new to me. Hello. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just shocked that you would even ask that kind of a question. Holy shit, you got me off guard with that one. Fuck. <laughs> Why are you fucking shocked that I'm going to ask a question like that? Have you not fucking met me? What the fuck? How are you shocked? Okay, okay, good point. I should have expected that one from you. you I should have expected it. it. You should have. Yeah. Can I still be your sister? You're shocked, I said. Oh, shit. <laughs> why did I, I hurt something? I, hold on. Nora said, should we give the sexy education to Josh? Wrap it up before you tap it. Wrap it before you tap it. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I just keep hearing that girl's voice. Can we still, can I still yeah. be your sister? Yeah. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Hold on, Nora. That's good. Further. Some little fucker can get a condom and, and another Josh can be made. Just go snip. Go Squirrel get rid of it all. Massachusetts, Josh, exactly. I, used to, I lived in Florida for 16 years. Hey, back in and, Massachusetts. He's a man. <laughs> Hello, Joanna. Hey, Joanna. Mom, leave me alone. Oh, I'm but, a oh, fam. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Maybe Carrie Ann. Maybe. Don't forget the red rocket, Nora said. He may have been more I'm than trying drinking. to add Captain in my eyes are too much of a question. Wow. Welcome back to hey, Justin. <clears throat> so uh um... Brain. Who's brain? I'm sure you've been hanging out for a little while, but uh, just catch up on things. Um, Josh is actually good to see you, squirrel. It's good to see you too, Captain Jerk. Josh is uh, 28. Uh, he has been deflowered and uh, currently not looking to have any children. So, <laughs> yeah. That's good a hard night, hell no. Let's see. It's a hard hell no. Was and he hard, really? Also, maybe getting a haircut soon. I'm not sure. Fish, you missed um, a whole lot, just so you know. Um, probably like uh, Wednesday or Thursday or something like that. We couldn't even try to catch you up. And Josh, Josh, you need to do us all a favor, okay? SPCA and everyone, and even Dan Jenner was talking about this the other night in chat. It is friendly, and, it, and it's humane. Make sure the stray cats are spayed and neutered. So you need to go get neutered. <laughs> go control the pet population. I, say, I, think I'm gonna, I think I'm going to start doing the end of all my videos. No, I'm not. No. <laughs> we so, need to spay barker. or neuter squirrel barker. our animals. So Dogs or cats up, or Josh's or... Thanks for having I'm me up, Lisa. Hi, Hi Driss. You're welcome. Good to see you, girls. Ladies. <laughs> Mike, Anthony, Squirrel. Jojo, thank you. Josh, you how you doing? Jojo. Sorry, it took, sorry it took me so long to get to my panel, Captain. My eyes were watering and I couldn't see very well. 
Were you crying? I'm laying on squirrel. Oh. That wasn't me, dude. You have okay. to have to work on it. wasn't me. I heard the screams getting louder. Wasn't me. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going there, Captain Jerk? What? Fucking working for you. I said, how's it going there, Captain Jerk? How's it going, dude? Um, I'm doing okay. How are you doing, oh, fuck? Captain? I'm doing good, man. I just pretty much uh, having fun up here in chat. Sweet. Or doing uh, whatever you want to fucking call it. I'm really glad that you're having fun, Josh. Uh, um, this this uh, is honestly what I need. This is honestly what I needed to make my night. Thank you guys. Oh yeah, buddy. I'm glad we could make your night. <laughs> hey Anthony. Yes. Hey Anthony, I do apologize if I almost killed you, man. That was not my intention. <laughs> Well, you need to be careful of the guys that have heart problems, Josh. Yeah. Listen. I've <laughs> too many <laughs> you fucking, You're apologizing to Anthony. We almost lost Mike three times during that story. <laughs> <laughs> he was, he just in the hospital this past yeah, fucking yeah. week. He's a lot of pressure out of the hospital than I am. Three times. Hey, Mike, Mike, just had Mike I do apologize. Oh, Josh. Yeah. Listen, when the whole thing started, he almost fucking wiped out. He was trying to sit, he was trying to sit down. <laughs> Bruce Mike, said, I... Bruce uh, said, said, Faye and Nudie are pet cats and dogs along with your strange friends and neighbors. <laughs> cats and dogs living together. It's funny that you guys were talking earlier. That's um, hysteria. About Muggsy. Because uh, Josh is the second person on YouTube that I met that needs to uh, perhaps be uh, chemically castrated. And Muggsy was the first that I thought that about. <laughs> yeah. um, I can't imagine why things didn't work out with him and the witch. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, Dave, what do you mean by that, man? What do you mean by that if you don't mind asking? Just by being Josh. I'm just being you, man. Oh, you're fucking, you're goofy you. son of a bitch, just like me. I'm you just, add I'm something like... special to every stream that you're on, Josh. Yeah. Okay, and... I'll take that as a compliment then. Good. Uh, I'm glad yeah. you do. You should take it as a compliment. Yeah, because don't ever take us serious. Never. Yeah. <laughs> take who seriously? What? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I've never been serious in my life. Oh, yeah. Uh, hey, Carrie Ann. Oh, yeah. good God almighty. Hey, Mike, sing it. <laughs> uh, speaking of, I'm just saying hello to Carrie Ann. Uh, Josh, have you ever had a coffee? Also, I'm not saying Muggs is not great. Dave, I, I agree. Muggs is a great guy, but chemical castration would do society a favor with that guy. That's all I'm saying. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> I think we guy. should take Mike's, Mike's meaningful sigh and, and, and freaking, like, loop it around so it, it plays, you know, to to a nice freaking fat beat and then freaking, like, have, have some squirrel nuts on there and then freaking, you know, like, like a bunch of Anthony cackles, you know? Hey, yeah. hey um... I'm going to say one thing right now, Dave. I will not change who I am for anybody. No. no. I'm not going to change at all. Sure. It's like this, okay? Whenever I'm on panel or in chat or even watching our own town, people, what you see is what you get with me. What, that's all there is to it. What you see is what you get. If you don't like it, cool. Now, John, but, tell me, you try yeah, to change one person, person, right, yes. Uh, nah, Anthony. To be honest, I haven't. I haven't tried to change at all because of the simple fact of if I tried to change, I wouldn't be me. And exactly. I love being. And I no. love being me because, like, uh, like Dave said, 
I bring something special to every channel <coughs> and chat that I'm in. And I appreciate him saying that. I'm not going to change who I am at all. And oh, I was going to reply. Anyway, I was going to reply to you, but I'm not in that chat. But I can see you in the general chat, so that's fucking crazy. Holy shit. Every four days, that's nuts. So this is the why this, this chat confuses me. I can't. Yeah. And Mark, I heard that shit. You can you know, wait till the fucking camera's off, motherfucker. Thank you, so who's up for a, uh, Carrie Ann's here. Every time she comes around now, I always want to know who's up for a coffee animal. Oh, Anybody? Coffee animal? Hey, coffee animal? Coffee hey animal? go fish. I agree. I agree. Being yourself is important. What and if people don't like people like if people don't like other people for being themselves, that's on them. That just means that they're insecure and don't like people for who they are or what they stand for, like with me. I'm a wild, crazy son of a gun, you know? And I love that about and I love that about myself because it not only keeps like the live streams I'm on on their toes, but it keeps my family and my friends on their toes as well. And I love that about, and I love that about myself, because that's what makes me me. I have no one to do a shot with. Just to drink two of them. Just have two. All I got right, water. Dave Dave Larson. Hold on, Dave. All right. What's Lisa got to bring, Dave Larson? Uh, Are you gonna bring something special? Oh. No, no, I think I gotta work and get up. Even if it's coffee, that's fine. All right, <clears throat> if you got any guys around doing math, four strokes will get you a drink. <laughs> hey, B lady, you, hey, you're damn straight. My name is Wild Man, and that's because I do wild and crazy shit that no, like to where no one expects. What I'm gonna do, and that's what I love much. about it. You tell her. You're like a 20 year old. And by the way, oh, by God, the way, this God, is. God, I need you to be quiet for a minute. I got to play. Okay, here, here. I'm gonna mute my mic. Yep. Oh shit. Hold on. Oh, thank God for what it's called. Stops. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we all took a moment of silence. So. I'm gonna mute you all. Wait, hold on. Oh That's shit! That's all I got. We got another super chat up in here, baby. <laughs> Thank you, you one and only true G for donating to the cows. We feel it, homie. <laughs> Okay, now I can talk. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> and now I can do my shot. Hey, Gail. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Yep. Hey, Cheers. Um, yeah. guys, guys, this is to everyone on channel and in chat. Stay true to yourself. Don't let anyone change you. Everybody is awesome. In, hey, everybody is awesome in their own special way. And and if and if people can't take you. For what for what they get with you, and they don't need to be around you or in your life. And, and that goes to everyone in chat and on panel. Me too. And and yeah, you too, Scroll. Be yourself. Hey. Uh, everyone in chat and on panel, be yourself. Josh speaks for gospel, people. Hey. Everybody is awesome, and I am happy to uh, to know every single person on panel and in chat and on the streams that I go to, because honestly, y'all are awesome, and I'm happy to know everyone. So, yeah. so shout out to everyone in the panel, in chat, and on the live streams I go to. Tell Same deal. Gosh. Oh, by the way. Hey, by the way, one last thing because I gotta go eat dinner, all right? If anyone tries to hey, if anyone tries to change you, tell them wild man said fuck you and you ain't gonna change. Okay. 
But hey, guys, hey. Thanks for having a fucking guy around. That's great. Hey, Doris. Guys, I got to go eat dinner. I'll be back on the panel later. I will Thank catch you all later. Thank you, Thank you Josh. Josh. See ya. Stay awesome. Hey. Be true to yourself. I'm out of here. This guy is awesome. He's, I didn't realize. I give you Josh <laughs> the wild Josh. man. Well, where does Wild Man live? Where do you say he lives? He's just having dinner now. California. I, I live in two. No, I live in Tucson, Arizona. Arizona. Sorry. What time is it? Arizona. Is it Ten o'clock there or nine o'clock? Yeah. It's actually ten after eleven, to be honest. <laughs> ten after eleven, and is eating dinner. Yeah. That is a oh. wild man. That is a wild man. Yeah, it's, it's very wild. Hence the name in the freaking. Pin- that's right, Josh. Tell him. Hey, he pulls Go eat dinner, Josh. Bye. Fucking scared. Him, no, I kicked him. Go eat dinner, Josh. Bye. <laughs> Bye, Bye, Josh. Bye. Squirrel, goodbye. Bastards. <laughs> See, I hear that? It got really quiet. Right. Yeah, it did get really quiet. Oh, I'm, listening, I'm listening to the Ford's rust. His uh, his voice is still echoing through my fucking head right now. So I'm just, <laughs> like, like a fucking echo chamber. I can hear him in there right now. I can hear Angel Minas laughing right uh, now. And we I got know. Chris. Hey guys. <laughs> Hi, Christina. Hey, how are you? I'm outside walking the dog. Walking the dog. Walking it's crickets because we need a moment of silence. Dog, so got, it was cold. I was going to say, cold? I hope that you can fill the shoes that you replaced. Huh? Yeah. There's only one person that can fill those shoes, and that's Muggsy, and he's not here. Doris. I love yes. you, but I'll tell you. Or Angel. Or Angel. <laughs> I love you, but I'll cut you. I'll cut you, bitch. Hey, Jimmy. Yeah. I'll cut you. I, I, I cut you so bad. You you wish I didn't cut you so bad. I know that, now, that, uh, now that Josh is gone, I uh, love the guy, but uh, we lost the guy who's louder and more obnoxious than me. Um, so. So is it possible that we can get Jimmy to replace him by chance? It could or? be. When I last checked with Jimmy, when I couldn't stop laughing and I had to leave the mic, Jimmy said I gave up when Josh came on panel. Oh. So now that Josh is gone, maybe I will go see and I will see what we can do. Oh, it's, it's, <sighs> no worries. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be leaving soon anyways. No, I... I I'll see what I can do, Tony. I don't want to disappoint the fan. Make it all about me. Is that nice? I know there's a fan club. We will see what we can do. Josh, act like we give a a fuck whether you're on panel and we're still going to talk. Well, I'm great at everything, so enough about me. Let's talk about me. It's more about Jimmy being able to see me before he goes to bed. Not That's not about me. It's about him being able to see me. That's what it's about. Uh, right. It's about Jimmy happy. It's about Jimmy doors. It's always about fucking Jimmy. Because the world resolves around <laughs> Jimmy too. Uh, have you guys? Do you guys know? You guys know Blake TV? You know Blake? Anybody? Yes. No. The guy's fucking hilarious. Uh, I was yeah. on. I was on with him one night, and he was doing his Jimmy impression. And uh, well, hello. I don't really so. And he was like, he was like, yeah, man. He's like, he's like, he's like, he's like that, 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 you made. That, that sounds like Elvis. <laughs> he's like, he's like that video you made with me and Jimmy. He's like, that was hilarious. He's like, he's like, I love it when Jimmy comes on here. He's like, he's like, oh hey, Blake, Blake. He does Jimmy impression. You gotta hear it. It's fucking hilarious. <laughs> you go over there sometimes. Just ask me to do the Jimmy. It's really good. I don't do the Jimmy. I don't. I don't have a good Jimmy. It's oh, good. Yeah. There's well, the back. 
Captain, you got friends. I do. Do you? Yes. Huh? How do I have friends? go smoke a cigarette out of your back. How do, I have, how do I have friends? In what alternate universe do I have friends? It says, Captain, how are you, my friend? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I'm your friend. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, Captain has friends. <laughs> that's so nice. How are you, Lisa? Superstar. It makes me feel warm and gooey good inside and knowing that Captain has friends. Oh, that's all gooey. Warm and gooey inside. Gamer does a funny Ken cool. impression. Mm. Well, I don't know. To prove that Gana Gamer will have to come up here and show his Ken impression. I would love to hear that. I've actually been uh, I've, I've been working on mine. It's not very good, though. And but Tony, uh, I have yeah. to say, I went to pass on your message. Yeah. And the king... Had bed. on his headphones and said, I could hear. And I said, okay, so you know that your presence has been requested. And he said, I could hear the show. Go back in your hole. As soon as he shows oh, up. Wow. As soon and as he I shows said, up. Fine. <laughs> fine. He pops on. I'm fucking out. I'm leaving. I'm out. What do you got? Yes, B lady, I did. Would you like oh. to see? Here you go. Here is some rubber skulls that I made just recently. Oh my goodness, Jimmy. They are purple and they are squishy. <laughs> and they bounce too. I can't really show you that right now, but we have Captain showing a squishy skull, Christina showing a flower. <laughs> it, it's an orchid. <laughs> Bruce said, "I am Jay's friend. He pays me enough each month." By Jay, who do you mean? Do you mean Justin? Do you mean Jimmy? Well, I have a guitar. Not, not one lesson. I. Fucking on, well, I'm saying. So I might be doing a might be doing a live feed video from uh, the Hard Rock. Who's at the Hard Rock? Me. I might be doing a video from there. Oh. Either Friday or Saturday. Very nice. Very nice. Am I going to be gambling? No. <laughs> Apparently, Captain, you have. People fighting over who are going to be your one friend. It's, uh, it's, it's I a friend to everybody. Inside. I'm pretty sure I know who I know who that is. The only, condition uh, is. the only conditions I have is that you don't rob me, you don't beat me up, and you don't kill me. That's pretty much it. <laughs> That's oh, what we do we owe the president? Of Cause, thy Lord. Because you dragged my ass Savior. into it. Oh, fuck. Dragged my ass into it, woman. I was trying to be chill. Yeah. Playing yeah. my games, oh. watching videos. Hi, Jimmy. Like, but thy Lord. Jimmy, what game your, are you playing? Jimmy. What's going on, your, dude? Your what game are you playing? village requested uh, your presence. My village. My village. I just played salt, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <I> mean, <laughs> to my... Some cold. I'll even go fish. Like Jimmy sees our piddle now. Whoa, geez. <laughs> <laughs> well, y'all. I was just trying to be chill, man. Mr. Yeah. Man, Josh was up there hanging out. Um, Fucking, yeah, that was enough of me. Yeah, Fucking. Yeah. Oh, my God. That know? was so fun. You missed. I didn't miss anything. That was I ran fun. away. I that ran away, funny. man. As soon as I fucking heard that motherfucker. You didn't even have your headset on. I so didn't need to. Listen. I didn't need to. I didn't need that to. Was fucking, Tony, that was fucking. Anthony had to leave. Yeah. I'm going to leave fucking. Because he's like, fuck, man. That kid's voice just runs right through me. 
like like lemonade or diarrhea? Like fucking dynamite, dude. Like, you know, fucking, uh, we were all worried oh, about what? Mike that he was gonna have another fucking heart attack. We were like, Josh, the man just got out of the hospital. Give him a break. And B Lady <laughs> wants to know do you ever win against computer solitaire? Huh? B Lady wants to know, do you ever win against computer solitaire? Yes, quite often. Yeah. Me too. I used to, yeah. Quite there, often. There's no solitary in Windows 10. But, yeah. uh, the one I have, anyway. You can oh, get it. For Jimmy C. Just stop well, it. Yeah. Stop it. I, I, I bought the, the higher version one. The normal one has solitaire. Mind up. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm about to beat this game right now. Freaking, just a matter of Chucking and jiving over here and getting to the last little bit of freaking bullshit. B said, Jimmy, I am learning chess. Oh, that's a whole nother battle. Fucking yeah. computer chess beats me up fucking like, like a redheaded stepchild. Yeah. So Lisa was smart. When she joined my stream, she started streaming it on round table. So we're both that's why I have twenty at one point, we had 26 people in here. You think that's why? I think it's that's why you don't have... I think that's knows. why freaking you get a split screen. You got some people over there and some people over here. If you were only over here, they'd all be over here. But that's just my opinion. Whatever. I'm still getting the views, I think. Yeah, hey, you're getting some kind of view. Oh, yeah, you're up in five hours getting these fucking kids up for school. Yes, we got you. Um, we canceled the Netflix account because with Comcast, we get Netflix for free through our Comcast subscription. Oh. So I thought, why pay for it if we get it anyway? So we have. Um, Netflix. I'm sorry, I pressed the wrong thing. That's all right. I kind of figured you went towards the duck. What? I kind of figured you. Hi, Go Fish. Go, Joe. Good to see you. There's what did you cancel? Ah, uh, Netflix. Oh, okay. You get it free through our Comcast package. Oh, cool. We get, um, Netflix, we get Hulu. I think we get um there's a bunch of streaming apps we get through our Comcast cable subscription. So I was like, why pay the fifteen dollars a month if we're gonna get it for free? All right. I was getting um, like uh three I think it was three apps for free and I I, I never got them because I'm like well I watch everything on Netflix. If I'm not on Netflix, I'm on YouTube on uh what is this? The Disney Plus and I'm like fuck it, I, I don't need no more. That Disney Plus is badass. Oh, okay, B. Yeah, I watched um I got into the crown. Where the hell do you see B lady? Oh, never mind. You're on Lisa's. You have to be on StreamYard's um, yeah. chat. Yeah, I'm all set with that. Thank you. And then you can see both. She's on Lisa's stream. I know. I got it. I figured it out. I, yeah. I got I got, I got so happy when I saw B Lady. I'm like, oh my God, this is the first time I see her. Huh. Yeah, B, I got into it's called The Crown on Netflix. It's all about the um, British Empire's royalty, like, history, like King Edward and all of his lives. And I saw that on my, on my, on my stream on, on Netflix and I'm like, yeah, it's, no, I don't think so. Oh, Fish, you don't have to do that, honey. If you want to stay on one stream, you can stay on one stream. How come she's not on panel? Oh. 
Mer I don't know why. <laughs> what would you like to be on panel of? I know oh, depending yeah. on what's going on at the house, she can always be on panel. Yeah. She'll she'll come up when she's comfortable. Right. right. Sometimes she prefers to do that. Uh -huh. Just trying to get both equal love. Uh, season two movie that is about a girl who is a chef strategy who becomes the world. Very nice. You have to check it out. I don't watch much live TV anymore. Um, pretty much watch the same shows. Other than that, I'm on YouTube. But I will make it a point to check it out. And Fish said, I like swimming back and forth. It's fun. Seth is back. I have what Fish does, you know. Tomorrow night, I'm taking a YouTube, a Facebook vacation. I might take a break from YouTube. All right, Seth. Speaking of which, Jimmy, I was going to say, last night, Cash was telling me that when he does stream yards, he goes back as a stream on YouTube, Facebook, he said that he's able to monetize Facebook, even though he's not able to monetize YouTube yet. So I was thinking about maybe checking that out. Because he said he doesn't have enough subscribers or watch hours to monetize YouTube, but that Facebook would let him monetize his streams on Facebook if he goes on Facebook Live. Oh my. When it comes to my Facebook, I have none of the cheap ass people. I was thinking about checking that out. Yeah, I don't I, know about monetizing Facebook either, B lady. I, I, he just said when he goes on Facebook Live, it comes up with a option to monetize the stream. I've never Facebook Live myself, so I don't know. That's why I thought that I would check it out for myself before I, like, told everybody you could do it. So what is Facebook anyway? Seriously? I've never had a Facebook. I don't know what it is. It's like <coughs> a platform. Do you know MySpace? Captain. He has a face like mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I've just I've just never had a Facebook. I, I do not have know. Facebook, Christina. I've had plenty of MySpace accounts, but I've I've never had a Facebook. So space uh, Facebook is similar to MySpace. It's a little different. There's other it's things you can do on Facebook now because it's been around so long. You can live stream on Facebook. Yeah. Uh, I've yeah. never done it, so I don't know, like, the particulars. Hmm. In, in Spanish? No, it's it it's sounds called... kind of pointless because you can do all that on YouTube. Right. <laughs> you on Facebook before you can monetize on YouTube, that would be, like, a whole new thing. Be well, like, no, you. I've never had Facebook, and or no, I've never had a Twitter account either. And I closed my Instagram because I never used it. Like my Instagram it is really easy to go live on. Twitter and Instagram, I literally use to hook up with people on YouTube. Like I have a Twitter account 
for a long time, but I've never really used oh. it. Other than recently to send people on YouTube like links and things like that. Yeah, I I've never really looked into any of it, but like I said, it was just one of my friends that was on my stream last night that said when he streams on StreamYards, because it is an option on screen StreamYards where you can stream on YouTube and Facebook at the same time. BRB. When he streams, he's able to monetize his Facebook stream, even though he doesn't meet the requirements for YouTube to monetize on YouTube. And he said that he just started doing it, so he's not really sure like what the did it? monthly requirements are and things like that. He was like the monetization button just showed up one day and I clicked it just to see what would happen. I clicked it just to see what would happen. I never been live on Instagram. Yeah, me, me neither. I been alive on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. I was on Facebook Live one time when I got on my kayak and I was showing off the mansions that were there by the coast. And only okay. like two people showed up and I'm like, yeah, I'm done with this. Josh is coming back up. Oh. <clears throat> we ready? So that that uh, Facebook in Spanish is called Libro de Cara, o Cara de Libro. I, you don't have to bring John back up. I'm about to be going to bed. Okay. And if he comes up, Jimmy's going to leave. Very true. Very true. Lisa is deserting me. I got to go to bed to get up in the morning. Yeah. All I see is empty chairs. <laughs> right? Anthony's not in his chair. Jimmy's in his chair, but his computer's not on. Catherine's not in his chair. Christina doesn't have her camera on. I'm eating a cheesecake. That is why it is good to be content after Facebook. Well, I had Twitter. I had also MySpace. I got a little bit of MySpace, but Twitter, I never figured it out. Yeah, be usually Jimmy will put the link to my YouTube stuff on my Facebook. Um, the door. I got to jump now. See y'all later. I got to go. I got one more coat to put on the, the bathroom so I can call it done. Bye, oh. Anthony. Thank you for coming. Good night, Jim. Good night, Anthony. Did anybody even see that? See what? Never mind. Oh, my back is killing me. Watch the playback, Doris. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <sighs> what happened? Nothing. I, nothing. Apparently. <laughs> nothing. I gotta, apparently. I gotta watch. Yeah. Well, fish said, Captain, stop horsing around. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I didn't see nothing. Apparently, that's what we missed. Ish. What do you mean, horsing? I don't know any 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 of this horse play you speak of. Dave Larson said Captain did a nice dance. Well, what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> Apparently I just wasn't paying attention. One thing about all of these 
other platforms is that if you put your YouTube videos on there and someone watches them, the viewers come back to you. Right, me. That's why a lot of Thank people you, guys on YouTube will the platforms because they're counted towards the YouTube viewers. Yeah, Josh, we were thinking about ending. I know Lisa's leaving. Anthony laughed. So we may be um, rating soon. Or rating soon. We may be leaving soon. And Cash Von Esper. You know Thanks. what I don't like about Jimmy? Go you know fish. Cash Von, hello. Raid. All right, Doris, I'm going to go. I'm not going to end the stream. I'm just going to leave. Good night, Good night. Lisa. Love you all. Good Love night, Lisa. Tomorrow. Good night, Lisa. Good night. Apparently. Okay. <laughs> Lisa, so what are to go. Much love. Thank you, Carrie Ann, for coming up and hanging with us. <laughs> what I don't like about Instagram is you can't share your videos or your links uh, to that. So, guys, in Lisa's stream, Lisa's stream will still stay up. So, if you want to hang out for a little bit, it will um, stay up as long as I keep the stream going. If you want to give Lisa some watch time. I gotta put my. What, Christina? <laughs> I was gonna say I pulled my screen down, and I said it was three something, like four o'clock in the morning. I'm like, oh my god. Yeah, I hear it's only one thirty. Yeah, that's what it is. But my, I don't know why my screen said it was three forty-five. Dojo said you can cheer them. It's easy when you know how. Oh, he's probably talking about Instagram. Yeah, I have a, a Twitter. I never understood it. I, I know the email, but I don't know the password. So I'm like, nah, I'm not going to do that. Yeah, B, that's kind of like what Lisa and I are doing now with stream streams. Yeah. The round table stream and my stream. And I think we both get the views. No matter who stream the people are on. Come here. Come here. Come here. Hi, kitty. Oh, okay. Kitty, 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 kitty. This cat's always following me. I don't know where my kitty is right now. He's somewhere as soon as, in his... as soon as I come in, she's always on top of me. Usually Thomas is too, especially if I'm streaming. Okay. Go to sleep. I won't do the same. Nope. And you know you can't come in my room. Sometimes if I know one of my friends is live, I'll leave my computer on. <clears throat> And I'll go about my own thing. Don't forget, you need to comment ever so often to give them watch time, like once every 30 minutes. Thank you, Cash. Guys, what are you going to, what are you doing is giving your both views. Yeah, Cash. Um, so, 
Lisa and I have a shared StreamYards account. So we can stream on both our YouTube streams. Like, if I decide to stream on my YouTube stream, oh, I can also stream on my Facebook Live or any of the other platforms that I have connected to my YouTube. I haven't said that yet. We've only gone so far as streaming on both how do you do that? Um, you have to have a shared account first. Oh, account. okay. Yeah. Um, like Lisa and I have a shared account, so right. we can choose both streams or just one stream, depending on where we want it to show up. Because I was thinking about that, I'm like, well, damn, I could do the same thing with you guys when I go to the. Um... Uh, what is this to the casino? Yeah, you have to have a shared account with the person. That's the right. only thing. Like Lisa and I share a StreamYards account, so we share the cost. Okay. How much is it to uh do that? Stop it, close it out. It's. Two forty a year, um, or it's a monthly price. We chose to pay per year, um, and there's other people that may be joining in with us. Like we started it as like a trial period. Uh -huh. Someone else offered to pay part of the year for us. That's cool. For us to try it. Uh, so Cash said that he her she heard no. that Facebook Live requires a fan page. Apparently, he has two thousand views on Facebook with his games. I can't, uh, but I. <clears throat> I am going to bed. I'll help with commentary with you tomorrow night if you want. Okay, Cash. Doris is the best boss. Hoo hoo. Thanks, Jeff. <coughs> you, Lindsay, said, Doris Hack, I will join with you too. And Cash, who's always. Shouting out my PayPal. So don't forget to donate to Doris. Good night to everyone. Cash is like an awesome co-host. And just because of that, I will share 240 per year. Hi, hey, Seven. Hey, pal. <laughs> Hi, pretty girl. What's up? Give us all. What you want? God, you got some funky breath. Here, turn around. Hey, pretty girl. Hey, give us all. You're such a beautiful girl. Hi, Cat. Thank you. Girl. Oh, thank you. Okay, get down. Wait, give me my headset. Seven, stop. Go. Thank you, Cash. I will see you later, buddy. Oh, my dog is awesome. Today I had a headache, and all I had was some Tylenol, and that's what I took. But I usually take ibuprofen, and somehow she found it just now. I'm like, oh my god, you're awesome! You found my ibuprofen. Yeah, the um, we chose to pay in the one lump sum 
book the year because apparently you end up paying more if you pay monthly. But if you pay once a year, it's something like $60 less a year than it would be if you paid monthly. I think that's with everything. If you pay uh, yearly, you pay less. Monthly, you pay more. Thank you, Fish. I'm glad you think so. Sure, B. Um, let me just talk to Lisa about it. And I don't see there being a problem with it. Oh, thanks, Dave. So Dave's yeah. not on here either? B, I'll talk to Lisa about it and we can let you know. Thanks, Fish. All you do, your thing just with like the watch time. No problem with no. All right, Fish. Um, sorry, B. All right, B. I should be able to talk to Lisa tomorrow and we will let you know. Yes, Dave, my chickens love me. I don't know why, but they do. Yeah, my, my head was just stopped. B, she's in my chat. She bounces back and forth, but for the most part, she's in my chat. Very true, fish. They are fluffy little balls of feather. My chickens are actually getting spoiled. They now stand, some of them stand outside of the coop for me to pick them up and put them in the coop. And Jimmy said that's because they know I will do it. I have the same problem, Doris. My chickens don't want to go inside. And I right. have to go chase them down, like, get inside. And that's like, oh. Jimmy. Jimmy has to chase them down with me. They'll walk right to the coop, but there's always two or three of them that will literally stand outside of the door and wait for me to pick them up and put them in the coop. I have to chase them in, and if not, they, they get on the branches, they get on every, everything except where they sleep all the time. That's the way it is with Jimmy. Jimmy has to chase them around. With me, they walk right to the coop. And the majority of them will get in. They'll hop right in the coop. But they'll stay out there and wait for me to pick them up and put them in the coop. My mom has the habit of always just opening the gate and they come out and eat around and eat everything. But usually when they see me come out there, they come running to me like, oh, she's bringing us food. I'm like, damn, I have to go get you guys something to eat to put you in. Yeah, as soon as I come home, they'll come running to my car. Like, Mama's. 
No. So did you end your stream, Doris? No, she didn't. Lisa ended hers. She signed off. Where this is she? stream is still going though, because this stream is still going. So her stream will end when I uh, control. Uh, what? 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 Chris Peck, oh, three cats. How you doing? Stop! You're going crazy. You're going crazy. Not many people are happy with Mad Jax. I don't to go later. No, wait. Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I'm getting tired. I was over there oh, freaking making a snack for me and Crystal. Oh. Oh, shit. Make a little bottle. We're going to have a pizza. We haven't had one in, like, a while. So we're going to have... We're going to have one. I've cut oh. back on... I've cut back on the pizza. I'm a bit of a pizza slut. So I'm just going to... Stop eating as much pizza. Yeah, I can already tell the difference. I've already, I can already tell the difference in my freaking guts. That you know, freaking, I, I don't feel as bloated because I haven't eaten pizza in like a week. You know what? It could be it, it, the same problem I have. As soon as I eat a pizza, I start getting this pain in my stomach, and it's not my stomach; it's my liver. No, it's not no. my liver. It, it's my guts. Mm. That's my liver. I, I don't have any liver uh, problems. I have a fatty liver, then I have um, stones in my gallbladder. Oh, stony gall. Yeah, so they told me it's from that, and then my doctor told me, we're going to have to operate. I'm like, listen, you're going to operate when I'm like, I can't take this shit no more. It's hurting, it's hurting. So then I'm like, yeah, I'm they're going right. to take your gallbladder from you. Yeah, no, leave it in there. It's good. No, they're going to cut it out. They're going to put a <laughs> tube where it used to be, and you'll be fine. <laughs> when I can't take the pain anymore, that I'm down and I'm dragging myself, then yes, till then. Yeah, they're going to they're gonna just cut it out. They're not going to play any bullshit games with you. They're just going to be like, snip, you're, you're good, go home. <laughs> That's what that's what they did to my mom when I was in the hospital. They yeah. they did that to her, and now my mom can't eat uh, any kind of like fatty meat that she loves to eat. As soon no, as she, do, lean, she does, you got to take better care of yourself. Eat lean meats and quit being a goof. <laughs> yeah, my my mother doesn't have a gallbladder. Somebody else in my family got theirs cut out too, and it's all women. All mostly women to get it cut out. There's a lot of dudes that do too, but no, it's mostly women that get it cut out because, you know, it's whatever. It's useless. <laughs> it's it's not really, you know, good for much of anything, you know. it's It just sits there? It, it, it's not necessary for it to be there, you know. Like I said, you just have to treat yourself a little better and you'll do fine. Cool. No, no, no. <laughs> Hold it on. I gotta go. This dog loves sleeping with my blanket. As soon as I go to work, I have to leave it for her. And past few days, every time I come in, it's laying on the floor. I'm like, are you kidding me? Mm -hmm. Same so thing with I, Joey. Yeah, as soon as I, I come in, I'm like, really? Really, yeah. Seven? You're just going to throw it on the ground and I pick it up? <laughs> yep. Tell me so we do the same thing. She'll ball my blankets up and like <laughs> lay on them and... So now what yep. I do, I leave, I leave it folded. I put it on top of the dresser. When I come there, home, it's right there. I'm not good. My blanket's not laying on the floor. Do you know why they do that? Because that's what they do. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I waited for an explanation. Like, why do they do that? That's just what they do. 
Every dog is different. You know, some dogs have very similar traits and some dogs are just wacky and they're freaking unpredictable and they do weird shit and you're just like, what the fuck? But no, usually that's just what they do. Usually it's because it's a smell that they're accustomed to. Like it's your smell. It's my smell, her smell. And it's like, yeah. oh, we're mommy's home. So, like, to them, it's like a smell, a comfort it's, thing. Yeah, I was going to say comforting. What? No, I got to go. I have to go drop something off. Mm-hmm. If not, she, sleep with, she sleeps with my pillow pet. She makes herself a little sandwich. She sleeps be- in, in between both pillows. Oh. Interesting. Is Darren? People were saying that they don't watch TV. I'm like, the only time I ever watch the news is when I go in my mom's room, give her something, and then leave again. Because mm-hmm. I don't, I, I haven't heard anything about uh, the hurricane that hit Honduras. I don't know if it hit Honduras or if it hit um, Costa Rica. I know nothing. That hurricane sounds like it's called Idiot. Oh, yeah. Be Lady and Go Fish. And Christina and yes. Doris. You're all invited to have some pizza if you want. But you got to get here first. <laughs> Thanks, okay. Captain. I, I think, think Doris I'll will get there. Forgo <laughs> the pizza. All, all you ladies can come and eat pizza with me, but you got to get here first. <laughs> you have to be here to eat it. I was getting, already getting my kids to be like, on, here, eat the pizza. <laughs> right through the camera. <laughs> B Lady wants to know Christina, are your relatives there? Uh, yes, I have a few cousins, a couple aunts, and no uncles, because they passed away. But I do have a lot of cousins. Well, Fish, how you would get there, I don't know what would be the fastest route for you to get there, but it's either by plane or boat, I think. Where? To Captain for pizza. Oh, okay. What is it? I ninety five or I seventy five or no? It's not I seventy five. It should be I ninety five or the Turnpike. I'm not is really sure. On, with... Over on your chat now, Doris. It's kind of both because Lisa's stream is still going. Like, well, I'm not gonna have two chats open, so. Well. Let's let's do Doris's then. You know. Well, then do mine. You're going to miss Lisa's chat, but... Um, ah. Fish, I don't know 100% where you're from. I want to say Florida, but... No. And Dave Larson already half oh. a homemade pe- home run pizza. Half for tomorrow. Go fish, take your helicopter, he said. I'm going to be in Doris's chat now. Because I'm reading Lisa's and it's not making any sense to what you're talking about. And I'm like, damn it! <laughs> I'm in the wrong <laughs> chat! <laughs> there oh, it is! I'm not now that I can you. see the helicopter comment. Awesome! And Go Fish says pizza! Yes! Hooray! But B Lady's not in Doris's chat. She's in Lisa's. Right. B-Lady. Sorry, B Lady, but I can't see your chat anymore. So, B Lady said you would think that you could Google where the hurricane was. Is that hurricane coming towards us? I, I haven't seen. Know, the, I think I haven't it would seen, depend on where you were. I haven't seen the news recently, but some people say yes, it might be coming over this way. And some of the people say no. But that was. It hadn't made landfall last time I saw it. I think that was the day before yesterday, or maybe it was yesterday. I'm not sure. Is that like making boom boom? 
Mm, I don't know. It was supposed to be a joke. Never mind. Rude. <laughs> like Rude the joke. <laughs> I'm, li- I'm listening to see if something said boom boom. I'm like, what's saying boom boom? <laughs> boom boom. Like it's like poop. Oh, okay. I just call it boom boom. <laughs> I like. Is that the song? A boom boom boom. All right. So caps to call the boom boom. I got boom boom in my panties. Crystal, that's all yours, love. Christina can pick me up, and then we go to see Captain for pizza. Yeah, because, (laughs) you know, Go Fish lives in Florida, right? I was like, wait, (laughs) who who am I picking up? (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Go Fish doesn't even live anywhere near the East Coast. I was going to say... I don't think Go Fish <laughs> lived in the East Coast, but not so much East Coast as Canada. <laughs> no, she's in the US. lady said the hurricane is a five. <laughs> you know you got funky breath, right? Mm? Yeah, my stomach. <laughs> yeah, B lady, I try not to track the hurricanes. The hurricane is considered to be the strongest. Oh, yeah. Country. Yeah. They've said that about a few, they'll be. And then once they yeah. reach landfall as of, like, the main coast, they tend to lose a lot of their speed. They gain a lot of the momentum when they're over the ocean. Yeah, B. She said, Dar is true. They always hype them up. And if they're over the ocean, I always think it's hard to guess what the momentum will be once they reach land because they always slow down to land a lot of times once they're in land a little bit ways in they knock them down to a tropical storm christina b wants to know if you're on the coast Christina. What? I'm here. I'm having problems with my internet. B Lady wants to know if you're on the coast. Yes, I'm on the coast. I'm yeah. smack between both coasts. Near the Caribbean, near the Gulf of Mexico. Right, fish, tell them, wake up. Everybody, wake up. <laughs> My internet was acting up. I'm like, oh, shit. So then I put the wife on the wife. I was acting up. I'm like, oh, that's great. And then she said, oh, she is awake. <laughs> what? No, I'm not sleepy yet. <laughs> Thank God my dog's a little dog. If she were a big dog, she would squash me. She loves sleeping on my chest. <laughs> but then again, I had a dog. Her name was Maya. And ever since she was a little puppy, she just sit on my lap. And then when she grew up, she was this 
big ass dog that love of lit- sitting on my lap. And I'm like, no, you're not a little dog. Yep. When my lab was a puppy, I used to let him sit on my lap. And Jimmy would say to me, you might want to rethink that. What you let him do as a puppy, he's going to think that it's okay if I have to do when he's big. And sure enough, he ended up being a 90-pound lap dog. That looks good. Pizza. Cut in a couple pieces. And I'll be there in a few. I'm picking up goldfish and then we're going to go over there and get some pizza. I'm not doing a delivery. (laughs) (laughs) Pizza. I just subscribed to your channel. To be ladies' channel. Nice. Yeah, she has a lot of um, good concepts on there. Yeah, I want to get rid of those bees, and I'm like, how do I do that? And I don't want to get them and kill them. I got rid of them once. Fish said, road trip. (laughs) (laughs) Road trip for Captain's Pizza. Pizza and a few skulls. (laughs) Don't worry, we won't hurt you. Rob you or anything like that because <laughs> you no, can come down as long not. as you don't as long as you don't uh what's it you said steal from me kill me and what was the other one yeah don't steal from me don't beat me up and don't kill me It's really not asking a lot, is it? Come on now. (laughs) (laughs) I don't know. Before I used to watch so much TV. And now I don't. I don't watch nothing. I used to love watching boxing matches. I don't do that anymore. Wrestling doors. I used to do it. I used to watch when I was in... I think elementary school. Yeah. And then a little bit when I was in middle school. You can still watch boxing without watching TV. Uh Huh? You can still watch boxing without watching TV. No, I watch it on my phone. Once in a while, I put on my phone and see... But when I started watching, I remember it was 15 rounds. I remember, I remember watching uh, watching boxing once in a while, but wrestling was uh, kind of my thing, you know. It was more of a storyline to it, you know. Kind of, I kind of like that aspect of it. Not not the drama necessarily, but uh, you know, a little little backstory here and there didn't hurt, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I gotta go get that pizza, huh? Yep. <laughs> I think the first uh, boxing match I saw was Sugar Ray Leonard. I can't remember this his, that guy's name now. It was Sugar Ray Leonard, and it was the guy that that was bald. George Foreman. No, not George Foreman. Remember, he wasn't heavyweight. Oh Lord, Muhammad I can't remember Ali? that. No, it was Muhammad Ali. It was a, uh, I think he was featherweight. And it was Sugar Ray Leonard, and damn it, I can't remember this guy's name now. It surely was not Butterbean. No, hell no. It wasn't Butterbean. <laughs> I think the last uh, heavyweight championship fight I got to see was the Russian guy, Vladimir. 
Mm-hmm. And then from there, I stop watching. Yeah, the um, wrestling doesn't have a set time normally. Back in the day, they had twenty minute bouts. But this there's year, no this match round. is scheduled for one fall with a ten minute time limit. Right, there's no amount of falls, unless it's like a sixty man iron match. I remember there was two guys they used to carry were were they two by fours or four by fours? Probably two by fours. It was in wrestling. Yeah, Hacksaw Jim. There was Jim one guy, Duggan. it was Hacksaw Jim Duggan. I can't think of anyone else that car- carried a two by four. I'm pretty sure Luke and Butch came out with two by fours a couple of times. Yeah, once or twice. <laughs> And they used to move their they used to move their arms like they were whacking something. Yeah, that was uh Yeah, like that. Yeah, that was the bushwhackers. The bushwhackers. And then you had Roddy Roddy they Piper. Used to each other's heads. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, ew, no. I don't want a pizza no more. What, because I said that right before I bit the pizza? (laughs) (laughs) One would grab the other one like in in like a little headlock like this and uh, I start licking his freaking head. I'm like, what is wrong with these guys? (laughs) Yeah. They were there for purely for comedy relief, though. <laughs> yeah. That they were. It's like what's his nuts of Santino Morella there. Yep. And doink. Doink, yeah. <laughs> Who's the guy that was the the Brooklyn brawler? Oh, I don't know his real name. I don't remember, but he, he had a bunch of different freaking personas. And one of them, he actually was Doink the Clown for a little while. <laughs> Yeah, I think quite a few jobbers did join the clown. <laughs> Sunday B. Sunday night is Survivor Series. Seven o'clock Eastern Time. I am planning on doing a live stream, so. Oh, yeah. It was Marvin Hager. Ah. Uh, it was 1987. Good night, B. The Brooklyn Brawler? Yeah. I remember seeing that. I saw it on HBO. But we didn't have cable back then, so I had to go to my cousin's house. (laughs) Oh, Doris. Yes, Captain. There is a man behind you. Yes, I know. Hopefully he follows behind me in bed, too. 
I can't guarantee he will, but maybe you'll get him for Christmas. Maybe. You know, I've seen him in okay. his. I've seen him in his freaking uh, in his uh, in his onesie. He can definitely hang a stocking if you get my meaning. <laughs> I do. I get you being captain. <laughs> that was disgusting. <laughs> Just putting it out there. <laughs> and on that note, Goldfish said like candy. Who has candy? If you want to call that a candy cane, I'll let you. <laughs> No, I thought you were talking about real candy. I'm like, who has candy? I don't want that candy. <laughs> I pass. That's not a candy. Is that a candy cane or a chocolate Santa? Doesn't matter. <laughs> Boy, I really gotta get this. I really got to get these teeth pulled. I got one on each side that gets food stuck in them. That's terrible. Does it hurt though or no? No, neither, both of them are dead. Completely freaking dead. There's no nerve. I don't even think there's a nerve in there anymore. Walgreens has this thing. CVS has it too. It's like a little ball. And what you do is you need it. And then you can stuff it in there so you won't get any more food. Yeah, those are only temporary though. Yeah, I can oh. go and get that dental cement stuff. But, nah, I just want to get them yanked out. So I don't have to worry about it anymore. Plus there's a risk of, in of infection if I don't. Right. One of them already was. I know my neighbor, um, he had that problem. He had an infection, and somehow the infection through the blood went to his heart. Yeah. yeah. And they had to do an open heart surgery. I was like, damn, I didn't know that. Yep. There's, um, there's a vein that freaking, you know, goes right back to your freaking heart from your teeth. And if you got an infection in the freaking root there, it'll get you. It'll get you good, too. A friend of mine has a similar thing. He had an abscess tooth, and it was affecting his freaking heart. And the doctor's like, that tooth's got to come out, and I'm not a dentist. So he freaking sent the, sent the dude right to the dentist, and that's where he went that day. He went right to the dentist office from that doctor's appointment. And that was back in 2002, 2003. And uh, right there, your daughter said, well, let me look up your freaking uh, your insurance. And he's like, don't bother. And he pulls money out of his freaking pocket. And the dentist said, that'll work. I can work with that. <laughs> it was he, better he, or Right there. Again? What, he what, that tooth out right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's what's terrible about having an infection is it's the what is it, lidocaine? It won't catch. You'll feel the pain. Yeah, that's why a lot of times they'll put you on antibiotics first. Because I remember I was fixing my car and my uh, the battery of the car fell on my toe. It broke it and somehow the nail cracked, which I didn't see it. Time went by and I it, my nail was bothering me and I, I pressed it. And when I saw it, it was full of pus. And I'm like, oh my God, this is all I need. So I went to the doctor and he gave me antibiotics, nothing. I went back and he just pulled it out just like that. There you go. 
That shit hurt. I was like, oh my god. Ninety percent of pain is anxiety. Some people even think that it's one hundred percent. One hundred percent of pain is fear. <clears throat> No, but if I have a bad tooth, I'm going to tell them, don't do anything, just rip it out. Let's say, be done with this shit. They won't always do that, though. My dentist will. Well, if you have a major infection, they won't. He will prescribe antibiotics like that. Right. He'll be like, take five right now. Right, like, but they're right not going to pull it right there and then. And then he'll make you wait an hour, and that'll send a blast of freaking antibiotics through your system. And then he'll freaking he'll sit there and yank that fucker out right there. No, no fuss, no muss. And don't you just love when you hear that crunch, crunch, crunch? Nothing dental scares me. <laughs> it used to when I was a little kid, but that was fear that was instilled in me by other people and the shit that they would talk about the dentist. So when I finally went to the dentist and I had a tooth pulled out, it wasn't that bad. And I was very upset. I was six years old. And yeah, over the years, I was just like, you know what? Forget it. I've been in too many freaking fist fights and I've been in too many freaking accidents and freaking had it been just been kicked around and freaking like wiped out on my bike and freaking just racked my teeth in on so many freaking things. I'm only missing one tooth in my mouth and another one shattered. That's because I had this one pulled out back here and the other one freaking it, it's most of it's gone. And there's just like one freaking like spike sticking up. It, it's, it's not sharp, but it, it's it's like one spike sticking out and that's it. That's all that's left. So I'm missing two teeth ever after all the things that I suffered in my freaking life. I'm only missing two teeth. And I've had my teeth freaking kicked a, a million freaking times. And they're still there. <laughs> so, yeah. If there's some painful freaking dental surgery, bring it on. Let's just get it over with. Let's, let's get it done. I don't even care. You ain't going to scare me. Drills? <laughs> Come on. They'll probably freaking set off my tinnitus. <laughs> yeah, probably. But... Let's just get it over and done with. What's the, what's, what's the difference? What's the big deal? I think the one thing that bothers me the most is when they try to numb it and they put that needle in. Other than that, it doesn't bother me. I jump a little bit when they put it in. You know how many fluoride treatments they gave me when I was a kid, go fish? Like, holy. With the freaking, that little foam tray. And then they take that pink freaking goop, lay, lay, lay a nice thick bead of freaking goop in that tray, and they put it in the upper, and then they do the same thing with the lower, and they make you bite down, and they're like, go ahead, bite down. I'm like, and it just mushes into your cheeks, and you're just like, because it tastes so nasty. And you're like, oh my God, I'm going to have my health. So gross, dude. And then you gotta like to get keep it in there for like 20 minutes or a half hour or whatever the fuck it was. And I'm like, oh, just turning fucking green because it's so nasty. <laughs> just made me want to barf. You have to get the mold or what? I get to spit it out and my freaking teeth feel like they're just rotting. And I'm like, yeah. But supposedly it's good for your teeth. I had the fluoride treatments, but it just freaking made them like gritty. Like, ugh. What was that so for? After that, if, huh? What was that for? Fluoride. But they I gave me. They they, but it was the bubblegum flavor one, so I'm like. Ugh. No idea. You guys never had that when you were younger? I don't think so. I don't remember. I probably did. I had that so many times, dude. It was. Good night, Seth. Good night, Steph. 
I was, I was oh, like, what is that? Do they, is that to take a mold out of your teeth or something? No, it's a fluoride treatment. I don't know. Maybe okay. it was something special you just did. Because Fish never heard of it. I never heard of it. Christina never heard of it. <clears throat> well, he was a pretty low-class dentist, too. I don't his, know. His, that dentist office was the shabbiest one I've ever been in. The carpet was just falling apart as you walked across it. And it looked like like it was an old like like part of a strip mall that actually looked more like a school than anything else. It was weird. And they had the freaking dentist office in there and I'm like Was this a seat was this a freaking like a factory or something? Like or a school? What the fuck is this place? It was just weird. And it was on it wasn't even in the front of the building, it was on the back side of the building. Toward the parking lots. You know? I'm like Okay. It was probably one of those, like, yeah, hidden doctors that don't have a license. No, he had a license. You know, he, he had freaking, like, degrees and stuff all over the freaking walls. He's like, here, but, uh, step into my van. I mean, my office. <laughs> no, no, no. There was, dude, there was a ton of people there, dude. There was a ton of people. But it was just a, it was just a freaking, it was, you know, it was just a shabby place. And it was cheap, too. It was real cheap. I remember that. So I'm really surprised that I got the freaking fluoride treatments that I did. But, man, were those things freaking revolting. Ugh. I couldn't believe how disgusting that crap was. And that's not the only dentist that ever made me suffer through that. Ugh. For years, from the time I was, like, freaking, like, 12 until I was... 18, yeah, I go freaking, yes, basically as a teenager, I still went to the dentist, but. I was going to ask, well, if it was pink and it tasted like bubblegum, it was probably that chewed up bubblegum <laughs> wrapper. No, you know it was kind of, just get it from the fluoride goop. You get it from the ice cream man. It used to come like yeah. in a little a little roll of a bubble gum. No, it definitely was not bubble gum. It didn't taste like bubble gum at all. It tasted like chemical goop. <laughs> I just got a notification saying that CVS is giving away the shots for flu shots. I'm like, yeah, I'm, just, I'm not getting it this year. <laughs> For the COVID shot or the regular flu? Flu. Just a flu shot. Okay. Yeah, because I trust those, too. Hey. I get your pizza? More yeah. pizza. I get Christmas pizza! <laughs> I think I'm going to call it quits. Just because mm -hmm. we've been on three hours. It's almost three in the morning. All Thank right. you all for joining. Thank you for having us. Love you all. Thank and good night. I will see you guys later. Have a good night. Enjoy your pizza, Captain. Thanks for having me, Doris. Mwah. Christina. Bye. Thank Mwah. you. Good night, lady. Good night, Mwah. goldfish. Good night, goldfish. Good night, Doris. Goldfish. Good night, Jimmy. Seth, everybody else that's left. Jimmy, good night. Have a good night. Good night, y'all. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye.